नमस्कार मैं एस एस रामन सीतारामन एस आई आर मिशन एम डी आर टी फाइव जीरो एट के तरफ से अपना मिशन है मिशन टी ओ टी मिनिमम एम डी आर टी जो है हमारा जो लोग है और अपना जो है यही में और अपना टारगेट आज 26 जनवरी 2023 हजार तेईस थर्सडे सेवन थर्टी पी और आज एक खास दिन है रिपब्लिक डे और रिपब्लिक डे का जो है पूरा भारतवर्ष में सभी को हम अपना मिशन एम डी आर टी फाइव जीरो एट की टीम के तरफ से शुभकामना देते हुए मैं एस एस रामन सीतारामन एस अयर मिस्टर संतोष टीटे मिस्टर विजय शिंदे और आपका अपना कहमत आशाद और साथ में हमारा गुरुवर मिस्टर रमेश बिजापुर सर और हमारा ब्रांच मैनेजर मिस्टर मेश राम के ओर से भी आप सबको हार्दिक शुभकामना जो आज ऐसा ही एक सब्जेक्ट को आपके सामने ला रहे हैं जो कहना कम शब्द है जो एल का कोई भी प्रोडक्ट है जो आज का स्पीकर है गेस्ट स्पीकर उनका इंट्रोडक्शन जो है आशा जी देंगे इनका हाथ का बना हुआ पीपीटी मैं बोलूंगा किंग ऑफ पीपीटी और इनके बारे में पूरा बायोडाटा और इंट्रोडक्शन जो है स्पीच जो है आशा जी देंगे उनके बारे में ना ज्यादा कहते हुए और समय जो है आज का सब्जेक्ट हम ज्यादा ना ही लेते हुए हमारा समय को सार को ज्यादा समय देने के हिसाब से जो है सब्जेक्ट एक आसान सब्जेक्ट है लेकिन कास्ट 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 करके प्रीमियम को देने वाला सब्जेक्ट है और आप इसको ध्यान से सुन के नोटिंग करके इंप्लीमेंट करेंगे हो सकता है आपको एक पॉलिसी में एमडीआरटी भी हो जाए तो ऐसा जो है सब्जेक्ट को लिया है और उस सब्जेक्ट का जो है जड़ से लेके और जड़ से मतलब प्रपोजल इनिशिएट करके प्रपोजल को पॉलिसी में कन्वर्ट करने के पूरा सूत्र फार्मूला बताने के लिए जो आज का स्पीकर को हम बड़े प्रयत्न के पास क्योंकि वैसा भी वो जूम मीटिंग वगैरह करते नहीं है लेकिन अपना जो है एक बहुत बायोकस्ट सार ने जो है एक्सेप्ट किया है और इसका फायदा हम लोग उठाना चाहिए बार बार ऐसा मौका ऐसा सब्जेक्ट में मिलता नहीं है जब मिल रहा है तो दोनों हाथ से लेना चाहिए तो ज्यादा समय नहीं लेते हुए मिशन एमडीआरटी फाइव जीरो एट के तरफ से मैं आपका अपना आशार को बुलाना चाहूंगा मिस्टर हेमंत आशा थैंक यू थैंक यू वेरी मच सर मेरी आवाज क्लियर है सर क्लियर क्लियर थैंक यू थैंक यू वेरी मच गुड इवनिंग फ्रेंड्स ट्वेंटी जनवरी सेवेंटी फोर्थ रिपब्लिक डे आप सबको शुभकामनाएं आज आप टाइम निकाल के हमारे साथ जुड़े हुए हैं तो डेफिनेटली आपको इसका बेनिफिट मिलना ही चाहिए सो so, फ्रेंड्स हमारा ये मिशन का पर्पस तो थोड़ा बहुत सीतारामन सर ने आपको बता ही दिया है ये हमारे इस जनवरी महीने का फोर्थ सेशन है हम 56 सिक्स फ्री सेशन आपको देने वाले हैं उसमें से ये अभी चौथा सेशन आपके पास हम प्रस्तुत कर रहे हैं फ्रेंड्स uh, ये जो पर्पस है इस मिशन का जो पर्पस है वो आपकी इनकम को डबल करना यही हमारा ड्रीम है यही मेरा ड्रीम है कि आपकी इनकम जो अभी तक है उसको डबल हो जाना चाहिए और आगे चल के आप सीओ टी टीओ टी एम डी आर टी ये टारगेट को अचीव कर सकते हैं दूसरी चीज ये है कि ये जो आज का दिन है ये एक दिन ऐसा हम सेलिब्रेट करना चाहिए कि इक्वालिटी आनी चाहिए सोसाइटी में हम सब एक तरीके से एक तरीके लोग हैं और हमें कोई डिस्क्रिमिनेशन नहीं होना चाहिए और इस चीज को साथ में रखते हुए हम आगे बढ़ना चाहेंगे दोस्तों ये जो आज का सेशन होने जा रहा है ये आपको YouTube पे भी अवेलेबल है और आप इसको फॉलो भी कर सकते हैं तो मेरी तरफ से मैं आगे बढ़ना चाहूंगा सर नेक्स्ट स्लाइड प्लीज कुछ अनाउंसमेंट्स मुझे करने हैं ये जो अभी आप स्लाइड देख रहे हैं ये है स्टॉल किट्स इंट्रोडक्शन ऑफ पावरफुल स्टॉल किट अगर आप स्टॉल एक्टिविटी करते हैं तो दोस्तों ये आपके लिए बहुत ही यूजफुल है और ये स्टॉल किट्स लेने से आपके जो बिजनेस का स्टॉल के ऊपर का एक्टिविटी है वो बढ़ा सकते हैं सेकेंड जो आप पोस्टर देख रहे हैं यह है मिनी स्टॉल एक्टिविटीज जो एक छोटा स्टॉल आप कोई एक सोसाइटी में या ऐसी जगह पे लगाना चाहते हैं और एरिया मार्केटिंग के लिए वो एक किट अवेलेबल है 
दोस्तों तीसरा एक एक्टिविटी के लिए है जो है कि प्रोस्पेक्टिंग आप कैसे कर सकते हैं स्टॉल एक्टिविटी से तो ये तीनों मिला के आपके लिए जो है ये प्रेजेंटेशन लाए हैं किरीट सिंगाणा सर और इनका नंबर मैं आपसे शेयर कर दूंगा नाइन एट टू डबल जीरो नाइन थ्री एट थ्री फोर आप इनसे डायरेक्टली भी कॉन्टेक्ट कर सकते हैं सर नेक्स्ट स्लाइड प्लीज ये जो अभी आप स्लाइड देख रहे हैं ये है हमारे अजीज दोस्त फॉर्चून मेकर्स के राजेश साटोस्कर जी का प्रोग्राम ये राजेश साटो जी साटोस्कर जी का प्रोग्राम जो है ये एटीन अगस्त को मुंबई में होगा कुर्ला में और इस प्रोग्राम में इंडिया के टॉप स्पीकर्स आपके साथ जुड़ेंगे और ये फुल डे का प्रोग्राम रहेगा सुबह आठ बजे से रात को आठ बजे तक और इस प्रोग्राम में आपको ब्रेकफास्ट लंच डिनर एग्जीक्यूटिव लंच चाय सब कुछ अवेलेबल है आप इसका प्रोग्राम का जो डिटेल्स है वो आप ले सकते हैं मैं उनका नाम आप नंबर शेयर कर देता हूं मिस्टर मुकेश जीरो नाइन सेवन जीरो टू वन सेवन सिक्स जीरो सेवन सिक्स दोस्तों आप इनसे डायरेक्टली कांटेक्ट करके आप अपना सीट बुक कर सकते हैं ये प्रोग्राम होगा एटीन अगस्त को तो इसका फीस होगा अराउंड सिक्स थाउजेंड और ये फीस वगैरह जो भी है वो आप उनको डायरेक्टली भेजना है आप हमारे साथ भी बुकिंग कर सकते हैं और ये जो बुकिंग के लिए मैं आपको बाद में भेज दूंगा लिंक कैसे बुक करना है सो so, दोस्तों दिस इज ऑन फ्राइडे इन मुंबई ऑन द एटीन ऑफ ऑगस्ट सर नेक्स्ट स्लाइड प्लीज ये आगे हम बात करेंगे मनीषा खुराड़े हमारे नेक्स्ट स्पीकर जो है उनके बारे में सर आप बता देंगे प्लीज जो है थैंक यू अर्षद जी जो अगले हफ्ते का स्पीकर रहेंगे मिसेस मनीषा खुराले मैडम जो है सीओटी एजेंट गैलेक्सी क्लब मेंबर और एक ग्रामीण इलाके से आके पुणे जैसा शहर में आके और इन्होंने जो है ऐसा व्यवसाय कर रहे हैं ये सोते हैं जब कम से कम रोज एक पॉलिसी बेचेंगे तब जाके इनको नींद आता है और बहुत डेडिकेटेड वुमन है और काम करने में पक्षम और सर्विस देने में बहुत ही माहिर है और इनका जो जोश और होश के साथ जो बात करते हैं आपको किसी लेवल का भी आप एजेंट रहेंगे आपको ऐसा लगेगा जो इस स्थिति पे जो एक लेडी एजेंट काम करके और कामयाबी एजेंट बन सकते हैं तो हम और आप क्यों नहीं है तो ये जो है एक बहुत मतलब कंसेप्ट ओरिएंटेड मोटिवेटेड मतलब सेशन रहेगा नेक्स्ट वीक का जो है मैं जो है मैडम के बारे में अगले हफ्ते और विस्तार से बात करेंगे सब्जेक्ट और सब कुछ और साथ में डिस्कलम है दिस लाइव वीडियो ट्रेनिंग प्रोग्राम इज एंटरली फॉर द पर्पस ऑफ इजी अंडरस्टैंडिंग फॉर इंश्योरेंस एडवाइजर्स एंड फील्ड फोर्सेस द टाइटल्स कंटेंट्स प्रोनाउंसिएशन इज फॉर अंडरस्टैंडिंग पर्पस ओनली द फिगर्स एंड प्रोजेक्शंस मेंशनड आर अंडर द करंट सिनेरियो एंड कैन चेंज और टर्म्स एंड कंडीशंस अप्लाई ये किसी प्रोडक्ट को इंडिकेट नहीं कर रहा है और सब चीज जो है आज के मुताबिक है और टर्म्स एंड कंडीशंस के मुताबिक बदली हो सकता है तो वेलकम टू ऑल पार्टिसिपेंट्स आज के जो है स्पीकर रहेंगे श्री पी श्रीधर सर चेन्नई से हैं और उनका इंट्रोडक्शन करने के लिए जा रहा है आपका अपना हेमंत आशा मिस्टर हेमंत आशा थैंक यू सर थैंक यू वेरी मच इंट्रोडक्शन uh, देने से पहले मैं कुछ चीजें आपसे बता देना चाहूंगा आप सभी श्रोताओं से आप सभी एजेंट फ्रेंड्स ब्रदर्स सिस्टर्स जो हमारे साथ जुड़े हुए हैं जो एल के रिलेटेड ऑफिशियल्स जो डेवलपमेंट ऑफिसर्स सभी को वेलकम करते हुए मैं आगे की एक दो अनाउंसमेंट कर देता हूं uh, दोस्तों आप इस सेशन में बीच में कभी भी आप हैंड रेज नहीं करेंगे कोई चैटिंग नहीं होगा और दोस्तों आपको अपने नाम से लॉग इन करना चाहिए अगर आप अपने नाम से लॉग इन नहीं करते हैं तो मुझे जबरन आपको मीटिंग से निकालना पड़ेगा जो मुझे अच्छा नहीं लगेगा सो so फ्रेंड्स uh, मैं आगे बढ़ना चाहूंगा uh, ये जो क्वेश्चन एंड आंसर्स जो भी आपके रहेंगे आप मुझे व्हाट्सएप पे कर सकते हैं और अगर वो योग्य रहेंगे तो हम सर से पुट अप करेंगे और नहीं तो फिर उसका रिप्लाई मैं आपको बाद में कल सुबह भी दे सकता हूं आप मुझे साढ़े पांच बजे से साढ़े आठ बजे तक कॉल कर सकते हैं और उस दौरान मैं आपके सारे सवाल के जवाब दे सकूंगा दोस्तों मैं आगे बढ़ना चाहूंगा आज का स्पेशल स्पीकर जो हमारे साथ जुड़े हुए हैं बहुत ही हॉनरेबल बहुत ही रिस्पेक्टेड पर्सनैलिटी मिस्टर पी श्रीधर सर है और ये बहुत ही हायर लेवल के एजुकेटेड हायर लेवल के ऑफिसर हैं जो आपके साथ आज सेशन में जुड़ेंगे और इनके बारे में मैं कुछ आपसे शेयर करना चाहूंगा इन्होंने एल के साथ जुड़े हैं 1993 से 99 में इन्होंने एज अ डी ओ टेक ओवर किया और चेन्नई डिवीजन में ये जुड़े हुए थे चेन्नई डिवीजन चेन्नई प्रॉपर में थे वो वो टॉपर रह चुके हैं चौदह साल तक कंटिन्यूसली 
और नंबर ऑफ पॉलिसीज में इन्होंने थर्टी uh, इयर्स से अभी इनका टोटल एक्सपीरियंस हुआ है जिसमें से चौबीस साल वो एज अ डेवलपमेंट ऑफिसर थे इनका एजेंसी फोर्स जो है वो 151 एजेंट्स का एजेंसी फोर्स है लेकिन दोस्तों यहाँ पे ये रुके हुए नहीं है इनका जो ट्रेनिंग सेशंस है ये बहुत ही बढ़िया लेवल पे है और बहुत ही हायर लेवल पे इनका ट्रेनिंग सेशंस चलता है ये ट्रेनिंग जो दे रहे हैं ये डेवलपमेंट ऑफिसर्स और एस के लिए स्पेशल ट्रेनिंग है मैं आगे बढ़ूंगा ये जो ट्रेनिंग का सिलसिला इन्होंने दो से शुरू किया था फ्रेंड्स uh, ये 2005 में इन्होंने सबसे पहले तो एजेंट्स लोगों को ट्रेनिंग देना शुरू किया था वही अपने चेन्नई एरिया में उसके बाद 2008 के पास पास उनको आजू बाजू में कर्नाटका केरला और साउथ जोन के ऑफिस से डिवीजन से उनको रिक्वेस्ट आने के बाद वो उनके तरफ भी ट्रेनिंग देना शुरू कर दिए थे 2014 में जब टेलीग्राम ऐप शुरू हुआ तो ये टेलीग्राम ऐप में उन्होंने जब ये मेंबर्स बनाए वो फाउंडर मेंबर बन चुके थे विकास अधिकारी एकता मंच करके उन्होंने एक प्लेटफॉर्म स्टार्ट किया जहां पे आप मानेंगे नहीं दोस्तों 8000 डेवलपमेंट ऑफिसर्स इनके साथ जुड़े हुए हैं 8000 डेवलपमेंट ऑफिसर्स एस इनके साथ जुड़े हुए हैं और पिछले एक दिनों से कंटिन्यूसली एक क्विज प्रोग्राम चला रहे हैं ये क्विज जो होता है ये सुबह में वो एक सवाल पूछते हैं और उसका जवाब दूसरे दिन सुबह में देते हैं और सारे डेवलपमेंट ऑफिसर्स और सारे एसबीएस जितने भी जुड़े हुए हैं आठ हजार से ज्यादा इनका नॉलेज बढ़ाते हैं तो दोस्तों ये हमारे जो आज के मेंबर है जो स्पीकर है बहुत ही बढ़िया चौदह डिविजन को ये इन्होंने सेमिनार वगैरह वेस्टर्न जोन के एड्रेस किया हुआ है दो से अठारह तक ये सारे वेस्टर्न जोन और नॉर्थ जोन के काफी एरियाज डिविजन को एड्रेस कर चुके हैं 2021 में इन्होंने फिर से तेरह डिविजन साउथ के रिक्रूटमेंट के ऊपर एजेंट्स रिक्रूटमेंट के ऊपर इन्होंने ट्रेनिंग सेशंस दिए थे और दोस्तों यहाँ पे भी अभी रुके हुए नहीं है इन्होंने 2020 में जब डिजिटल कोरोना बैठ गया था मार्च महीने में जब कोरोना बैठा 2020 में तब से ये प्रोग्राम उन्होंने स्टार्ट किया है क्विज प्रोग्राम फ्रेंड्स आज के ये जो स्पीकर हैं श्री पी श्रीधर सर इनके पर्सनल भी लेवल पे अगर मैं बात करूंगा तो इनकी फैमिली जो है इनकी वाइफ जो है शी इज वर्किंग विद हिंदुस्तान यूनिलीवर एज अ मैनेजर और इनका डॉटर जो है वो चार्टेड अकाउंटेंट किए हुए है और इनका सन जो है वो हाल अभी लॉ पढ़ रहा है सिम्बायोसिस कॉलेज में तो फ्रेंड्स ये है हमारे आज के स्पीकर श्री पी श्रीधर सर फ्रॉम साउथ चेन्नई मैं रिक्वेस्ट करूंगा सर से कि आज आपको आ, सभी को आप मेरे एजेंट ब्रदर्स सिस्टर्स सभी को एक इतनी सिंपल और इजी लैंग्वेज में आपके साथ शेयर करेंगे और जो टॉपिक इन्होंने आज सजेस्ट लिया हुआ है वो बहुत ही बढ़िया टॉपिक है और मैं उनके साथ अभी प्लेटफॉर्म देना चाहूंगा वेलकम प्लीज प्री पी श्रीधर सर आप प्लीज टेक ओवर कीजिए वेलकम टू दिस शो सर कैन यू हेयर मी थैंक यू थैंक यू फ्रेंड्स गुड इवनिंग टू यू ऑल इट्स अ रियल प्लेजर टू एड्रेस अ वास्ट गैदरिंग ऑफ एजेंट्स डीओस एंड एसबीएस एंड आई नीड टू थैंक आवर आईएर सर फॉर प्रोवाइडिंग मी विद दिस अपॉर्चुनिटी टू स्पीक अबाउट एनआरआई इंश्योरेंस and uh, enough introduction has been given about me let me not uh, waste further time on that and let me straight away jump into the topic in our insurance i hope i am sir i am audible uh, sir ji yes sir yes sir yeah yeah nr insurance a thorough study friends this topic of nr insurance basically you know uh, uh, it has been uh, neglected by majority of the agents for uh, two main reasons first thing majority of you are not aware about the rules and regulations that is governing the nr insurance second thing uh, you know we are not uh, confident enough to speak to people particularly nris about the scope of taking lic policy so these two are the reasons uh, uh, you know <clears throat> which had uh, prevented the agents from uh, entering into this uh, in our insurance arena today in this uh, session of mine i am going to completely thoroughly give you the features the the scope the rules the marketability everything about nra insurance and uh, here i start what is the scope of nra insurance it is an abundant and a perennial resource for us friends mera lecture it will be bilingual it will be in english and in hindi 
बहुत सारा लोग साउथ में ज्वाइन किया है तो इसलिए पूरा हिंदी नहीं चलेगा सो ट्राई टू एडजस्ट बिटवीन इंग्लिश एंड हिंदी स्कोप ऑफ एन आर इंश्योरेंस इट इज अबेंट एंड पेरिनियर रिसोर्स फॉर एस वाई आई से इट एज एनबेंट रिसोर्स ये है कि एज पर द मिनिस्ट्री ऑफ एक्सटर्नल अफेयर्स स्टैटिस्टिक्स थ्री पॉइंट टू क्रोर्स ऑफ ओवरसीज इंडियंस आर एनरोल्ड थ्री पॉइंट टू क्रोर्स उसमें इफ यू आर गोइंग टू गो इन टू दी इंट्रिकसीज दिस यूनाइटेड अरब एमरेज सेवन एमरेज आर देर ना शारजा अबूदाबी दुबई रसल कैमा दीस सेवन एमरेट्स में अलोन देर आर थर्टी फाइव लैक ऑफ इंडियंस आर वर्किंग ओवर देर सेवन एमरेट्स में then you see the saudi arabia in saudi arabia you have around 25 lakhs of indians if you take uh, us there are around 13 lakh indians working over there with indian passport needless to say that uh, uh, those indians jinhone nationality waha liya wo kam se kam 26 27 uh, lakhs are there so itna sara scope hai for us to uh, uh, tap that market so we need to understand thoroughly about nri insurance millions of nris look for their investments in india zarur jo log waha foreign country mein settle hote hai unka you know investment ka methodology alag hoga but jo log waha ja ke kaam karke those with the intention of coming back to india for them lic is one of the best avenues and we as agents divos and sbas need to know kya rule hota hai nri ka insurance mein kya kya रूल्स है क्या क्या स्कोप है वो पूरा वी आर गोइंग टू सी इन दिस सेशन प्रॉपर नॉलेज इज नीडेड टू अप्रोच देम यही मैंने पहले बोला था कि वी आर नॉट कॉन्फिडेंट अबाउट एनआरए बिजनेस क्योंकि हमको उतना नॉलेज नहीं है व्हाट इज द रूल हाउ आई माइट अप्रोच अ पर्सन इन यूएस हाउ आई माइट अप्रोच अ पर्सन इन सिंगापुर ये सब चीज आज आप लोगों को कंप्लीटली इट इज गोइंग टू बी क्लियर टू यू एंड फ्यू बिग एनआरए केसेस वुड मेक यू एन एमडीआरपी सी वन क्लियर फैक्ट इज दट अगर स्वदेशी के पास वी आर गोइंग टू गेट वन लैक ऑफ रुपीज प्रीमियम इट विल बी एटलीस्ट फाइव टू टेन टाइम्स यू कैन गेट इट फ्रॉम एन एन आर आई सो इन ऑर्डर टू गेट दट ह्यूज बिजनेस यू आर सपोज टू नो वॉट आर द रूल्स एंड रेगुलेशन दट आर गवर्निंग एन आर आई इंश्योरेंस क्लासिफिकेशन ऑफ नॉन इंश्योरेंस दिस इज दहला पॉइंट है आप लोगों को समझना होगा क्लैरिटी होना चाहिए इसमें What is the classification of non-resident? You know who are all non-resident. जो लोग भारत में नहीं रहते हैं, they are called as non-residents, right? ये non-residents में what are the two sub-classifications? First is called the NRI, second is called the foreign national of Indian origin. ये दोनों definitions आपको proper समझ में होना चाहिए. Only then you can Uh, confidently approach the customers because ye dono definition may the rules and the regulations vary the rules that apply to nra need not necessarily apply to fnio and vice versa so pehle aap ek customer ko chun liya to you need to first identify whether he is an nra or an fnio based on that only you need to uh, approach him and uh, you need to suggest the products right so today we are going to see thoroughly on these aspects also first of all who is an nri as aap dekh sakte hai jo banda inke paas passport issued by government of india so anybody who holds the passport given by government of india he is an nri citizen of india who is temporarily residing in some other country so jo log yahan ka citizen hai india ka passport उनके पास है वो टेम्पररली ही इज रिजाइडिंग इन सम अदर कंट्री उनको हम एन आर आई बोलते हैं लेट एस नॉट गो इन टू दी डेफिनेशन क्लासिफिकेशन ऑफ एन आर आई बेस्ड ऑन इनकम टैक्स रूल्स इनकम टैक्स रूल्स अलग है लेट एस नॉट कॉम्प्लीकेट द सब्जेक्ट विद इनकम टैक्स रूल्स एस ऑफ नो आप समझ लीजिए कि एनी सिटीजन ऑफ इंडिया हु होल्ड्स इंडियन पासपोर्ट हु इज टेम्पररली रिजाइडिंग इन सम अदर कंट्री इज अ नॉन रेजिडेंट इंडियन holding a valid indian passport holding a valid indian passport not a green card holder ye bahut important point hai nri ka classification mein uh why it is an important thing see we call who is a green card holder green card holder is a person in us 
who is getting permanent residency over there. It depends upon uh, whether it is 10 years or 5 years, they decide and uh, issue a permanent residence uh, card that is called as green card in US. In other countries, it is referred in different nomenclature. In Australia, it is called as PR. In Singapore, it is called as PR. In Canada, it is called as PR. Likewise, the ideology behind this is uh, a non-citizen of that country is allowed to stay in that country. So that is, uh, that, uh, the, that is the, you know, uh, idea of uh, this green green card or PR or, or whatever it is. So NRI jo hota hai, LAC may classification may he should not hold a green card or a PR. Any customer in any of the countries, if he is having a PR, we will not treat them as NRI. If he is having a green card, we will not treat them as NRI. This is a very important point. And the second point here is that customer should not have applied for citizenship of any country. This is the classification of LIC. Let us not uh, confuse uh, this classification of LIC with what is there in uh, reality in legal terms in our country. So whom do we treat as NRA in LIC? So a person who is temporarily a citizen, who is a citizen of India, who is temporarily residing in some other country, point number one. Point number two, a person who is holding a valid Indian passport, in ke pass, India ka passport hona chahiye. This is important point. He should not hold a green card or a PR. So, jinko, jin ke pass green card hai, we will not treat them as NRI, we will treat them as FNI. That is what I wanted to drive. Because rules are alag hota hai. NRA ke liye alag rule, FNI ke liye alag rule. So, he should not hold a green card, he should not hold a PR should not have applied for citizenship of any country. On the date of proposal, he should not have applied for citizenship of any other country. So if these four conditions are satisfied, in logon ko, we call them as NRI. So this is the basis, this is the pehla step for you people to understand as to who an NRI is, right? Next slide. Who is an FNIO? Who is an FNIO? FNIO means Foreign National of Indian Origin. FNIO stands for Foreign National of Indian Origin. So how do we uh, define that Foreign National of Indian Origin? Let me tell you an example. Assume uh, one uh, couple who are basically Indians working in Infosys or Wipro, they have gone to US. There, uh, a child is born to them. As per US uh, laws, any child that is born in that country, they will be considered as a citizen of that country. So here parents are holding Indian passport. They are Indian citizens. That child which is born outside India and which is born in US, that will be treated as a foreign national of Indian origin. Example ke liye ye bola, right? Here, what is the definition of LIC? Foreign national schools ancestors were or Indian citizen. What do our rule books say? Jin logon ko unka ancestors hai na, unka uh, father, grandfather, great grandfather. I say if any of the ancestors, it, it can run up to seven generations. If any one of them were Indians at any point of time, un logon ko hum FNI wo maangte hai. So anybody, unka ancestors were Indians. So presently the customer can be a foreign national, his father can be a grand, uh, foreign national. But if his grandfather were an Indian national at some point of time, un logon ko we call them as foreign national of Indian origin, FNIO. I think you have understood the basic difference between NRI and FNIO. Next point, OCI and green card holders are treated as FNIO. In this style, I clearly bola tha aapko, a, 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 a person who is holding a PR in any country outside India, we will not treat them as NRA, we will treat them as FNIO. OCA green card holders are treated as FNIO, right? So how do LIC decide this customer is an NRA, this customer is an FNIO? If he is not holding an Indian passport, we can say that he is an FNIO, right? For that, jin, if, us customer ko proof de na chahiye. He should either submit a OCI card. He should. He needs to submit some proof that 
my father was an Indian, father ka pan card, father ka other card, father ka ration card. Like that, some proof of Indian parentage needs to be submitted with the proposal. So, un logo ko, we will treat them as FNIOs, right? So, I think you would have uh, clearly understood and uh, you would have come to a conclusion or rather a demarcation between NRI and FNI1. This is the very important thing which you need to do as the first job whenever up uh, NRI insurance may karne ka, karne ka hai to you need to first find out whether your customer is an NRI or FNIO. Ye cheez chodi ke aap plan ke baare mein bol diya to kuch bhi nahi chalega. Go step by step, step by step. This is step number one, this is step number two, this is step number three. Right? First you identify whether the customer is NRI or FNIO. Jo cheez mene paanch minute bola tha, ye classification aapko zarur help hoga. First find out whether they are NRI or FNIO. Right? Next is an important slide, uh, my dear friends. Please note it down in your notepad. The important circulars of LIC. Uh, why most of us are not uh, aware of the facts is that hum logo circulars ko nahi padte. Whether it is an agent or a DO or an SPA, hum ko time nahi mil raha hai ya koi or cheese, we are not concentrating on that. So in this session, I am going to uh, uh, show, in fact uh, highlight just four important circulars. Ye note ki jiye, pehla wala circular ye hai, NB and R314, dated 11-10-2021. Please note it down in a piece of paper or in your notepad press. What is this circular? NB and R314, dated 11-10-2021. Ye circular mail order ka hai. Mail order business ka pura details is circular mein hai. It was introduced nearly one and a half years back, or rather one year and three months back. And that circular is going to be the basis on which you uh, mail order business. Kar sakte hai. So, so many changes have been, uh, welcome changes have come in this circular. Uh, jo changes LIC ne is circular, ka ne, uh, uh, whatever details they have brought in, that is really going to help us in getting huge business through mail order. So, the NB and R 314. Oh, mail order ka circular. I will elaborate uh, those things in the subsequent slides. Ye dusra circular. NB and R333. Uska date hai 11 5 2022. This NB and R333 ye kya hota hai? Aap sab log ko zarur uh, uh, pata hoga ki uh, LIC has introduced a new non-medical scheme called preferred non-medical. Correct? So in this circular, LIC has brought out uh, a new scope uh, for us to do huge business in the form of preferred non-medical scheme. All those things we are going to discuss in the subsequent slides. NB&R 333, a new uh, non-medical scheme named preferred. Prior to that, our past was just non-medical special, non-medical professional, non-medical general. A circular thak, only these three classifications we know. But after this circular, Circular NB and R 333, they introduced a new group called Preferred Non Medical, right? Next circular, it was issued just in one month's time from the earlier circular NB and R 336. Ye circular kya hota hai? NB and R 333 me thoda cheese LAC ne left kya hoga ya. We people could not interpret many things in the earlier circular. So, ye cheese NB&R 336 may LAC gave clarifications for the earlier circular. U circular may ye cheese, uh, it was not informed in the circular. Ye hai, wo hai. So, only if you read NB&R 333, you can understand something in NB&R 336. So, NB&R 336 is clarificatory circular to the earlier NB&R 333, right? And this is a very important circular, NB&R 349. It had put to rest all the confusions that were existing in our mind. Right? What this circular meant? Once again, LAC switched, on, switched over to the concept of uh, grouping the plans for non-medical. Grouping the plans. They gave two groups, group one, group two. 
group when group one may almost all the non power plants are in the group one uske sath sath hamara bahut favorite products like jeevan umang 945 bima shree 948 jeevan lab 936 wo sab group one ke andar leke aaya then they came out with the group two group two may our four or five popular products like 914 9:15, 9:20, 9:21, and 9:33. Jeevan Lakshya. So this grouping of plants came in this circular. Can be under 349. In addition to that, this is the circular in which they have revised the special report. Special report, जो होता है कि थोड़ा limit के बाद customer को ECG, FBS वो सब करना चाहिए. उसका चीज क्या होता है? So they came out with a fresh. special reports in our country many of us are confused about the special reports ka chart kisi log ke paas char special report chart hoga kisi ke paas eight special report chart hoga kisi ke paas 10 special report chart hoga but lic officially has only two special reports chart so this circular is very clear uh, about the special reports one and the special report chart one and chart two ye kya hota hai these things are also in the subsequent uh, slides i am going to explain so that aap logon ko kuch bhi confusion nahi hoga hamare customer ko kya policy dena hai us policy mein kya rule hota hai agar medical aayega ya non medical agar medical aaya to special reports aayega ya na all these things we are going to see i hope you people have noted it down nb and r 314 dated 11 10 2021 nb and r 333 dated 11 5 2022 NB and R three thirty six dated seventeen six two thousand twenty two. Then NB and R three forty nine dated twenty five eleven two thousand twenty two. So these four circulars, uh, at least from today, what I would advise all my agent friends, particularly and divorce and SPS, whenever a new circular comes, ensure that आप लोगों को वो circular मिलता है यू get it from your branch, your ABM or BM or through any other source. Go through the circulars. Because अगर आप updated नहीं है तो we will become outdated. As simple as that. If we are not updated, we are going to be outdated in this industry. So develop the habit of reading the circulars. And इतना आसान नहीं होगा LIC का circular पढ़ने के लिए. Uh, you have to read it at least three or four times to understand something out of it. But along with the theoretical knowledge, आप practically कुछ cases apply. किया तो देन यू विल बी वेरी स्ट्रॉन्ग इन बोथ थियरी एज वेल एस मार्केटिंग अल्टीमेटली हमारा इंटेंशन मार्केटिंग में जीतना है तो मार्केटिंग में जीतने के लिए सिर्फ मार्केटिंग स्किल्स मेरे पास बहुत ज्यादा है तो नहीं चलेगा इन ऑर्डर टू विन इन मार्केटिंग यू नीड टू नो द रूल्स अगर बेसमेंट इज नॉट स्ट्रॉन्ग देन द बिल्डिंग इज गोइंग टू बी वीक दिस बेसमेंट के लिए आप लोगों को सर्कुलर पढ़ना एक जरूर इंपॉर्टेंट रूटीन एक्टिविटी होना चाहिए so try to collect the circulars from the branch either through your do spa or through your branch manager all these circulars this is going to give clarity to you right this session mein mai char circulars ko mai thoda touch karke i am going to tell you all the important features in this right okay now nris and fni was can be allowed insurance isme do cheez hota hai if nra and fni wo they are On a holiday, they are here. Bharat me aaye hue hai Christmas ke liye, New Year ke liye, uh, whatever be the festivals and whatever be the occasions, if they are in India, what is the rule? An important thing which you need to understand is if the NRA or FNIO are in are in India at present, we are giving all non-medical concessions like preferred non-medical. स्पेशल नॉन मेडिकल अगर ये भारत में है तो वी ट्रीट दम एज रेसिडेंट इंडियंस फॉर द पर्पस ऑफ मेडिकल राइट सो अंडरस्टैंड दिस इफ दे आर विजिटिंग इंडिया वो आपका बहुत राइट टाइम है राइट टाइम है राइट अंडर राइट दैट टाइम बिकॉज आपका कंप्लीशन में प्रॉब्लम ही नहीं होगा अगर वो बंदा फॉरेन में बैठे है तो you will be encountering all the problems because we are not seeing them in person he will be away 2000 miles 3000 miles 4000 miles and aap whatsapp pe chat karte hai whatsapp pe video call karke sabhi cheez ko lena padega but if they are in india lic has relaxed the rules so non medical concessions are totally available to nris and fnios if they are in india yahan ka resident indian ka kya rule hai wohi rule nra and fnio if they are in india 
let, let us recollect preferred and special non-medical rules now. Right? So as I have told you, NB under 333 introduced this concept of preferred. Let me not go very deep into it. Agar am gaya to this non-medical ka, I mean this NRA ka topic ka dilute ho jayega, but simply I'll be letting you know what are the conditions. Who are all coming under preferred non-medical? Minimum a graduate or an engineering a diploma also. Minimum graduate people, uh, they should be getting an annual income of 10 lakhs. This is the rule for not only resident Indians, but also for NRIs and FNI. Oh, note KGA, non-medical preferred scheme is allowed to resident Indians and NRIs bar FNIOs who belong to residence group 5. So, residence group 5, kya hota hai? subsequent slides may you are going to understand. That is preferred non-medical. Here again, you need to apply the concept of group 1 and group 2. Let me not complicate about all the things. Sir. The limits we'll be seeing little later. So, what is the special non-medical? Special non-medical is that those employees who are uh, working uh, in uh, government service, reputed private establishments, special non-medical and special non-medical is applicable to resident Indians and NRIs only. So special non-medical FNIOs ko nahi milta. Please note it down in your notepad clearly. For FNIOs, non-medical concessions sir, preferred milta hai, special nahi hai. Right? So you have to, uh, you know, see all these basics before approaching a customer. Without profiling them, without knowing uh, uh, such rules, you cannot approach. If we know rules, then you can clearly say that, sir, you can give us 50 lakhs without medical. Right? 50 lakhs can be used as a talent you will have. But uh, without knowing the rule, if you have a business and you have to say that you need a medical or a special report, chahiye. after that second day when you are going to tell the customer you need to come for LIC medical, he will get irritated. Usually, resident Indians itself are very much aware nowadays. Bahut, you know, awareness of our customers, pe. they are all uh, more smarter than we in uh, insurance. So you need to be a real smart professional. How you can become a real smart professional? Only if you know what are the rules and regulations. So I say this special non-medical, the income for uh, these people should be 2.5 lakhs per annum. This is what has been said. If they are self-employed and if they are a non-graduate, they have to earn 10 lakhs. So this is what is special non-medical, right? And I repeat at the cost of repetition, preferred non-medical is there for resident Indians, NRIs, and FNIOs of group Y. Whereas the special non-medical, it is there only for resident Indians and NRIs. Uh, FNIOs for special non-medical concession, nahi hai, right? Now you go and uh, check in the office that NB under 333, 336, and 349, you will come to know what are the limits for what plans you can give. So on their visit to India, there is no maximum summer shoot limits. Earlier, so many years back, there, there were restrictions on the maximum insurance that we can offer to NRI, FNIO. As days goes by, uh, LIC has been totally relaxing on the maximum limits. Now, if an NRI is on a visit to India, unka income kitra hai, we can give insurance up to the income multiple given in our manual. So no maximum limit, sky is the limit, right? When they are abroad, oh, customer Singapore mein hai, US mein hai. So how we can give insurance? Formalities are completed in the country of residence. They are not here, correct? So formalities are completed in the country of residence. They call this as mail order because no, they are outside India. You are going to get it by mail. Mail means it's not email. It is, uh, they, they have to fill the form. They have to send it through courier or uh, whatever channels it is. Uh, so that is called as mail order in, in one way. So for that, uh, the minimum sum assured that uh, you can uh, give uh, when they are abroad, rather mail order is minimum is 10 lakhs and maximum mail order ke liye 3 crores ke liye ne bol diya. Note down these facts. If you are going to canvas for a policy with an NRI or FNIO who is presently Bharat mein nahi hai hai to, unko kam se kam aapko 10 lakh dena chahiye. Maximum it can go up to 
थ्री क्रॉस बट द सेम एन आर आई एंड एफ टू नाइन अगर वो इंडिया में विजिट करते हैं अभी एंड ही बी हियर फॉर टेन फिफ्टीन डेज योर मैक्सिमम समर शूट लिमिट नहीं है you can canvas anything these important differences you need to understand when they are here no maximum limit when they are abroad minimum it is 10 lakhs and maximum it is 3 crores right next slide residence group what is this residence group why residence groups have been formed by lic ye residence group kya hota hai see according to un there are 210 countries right सभी कंट्रीज ये की सोशियो इकोनॉमिक सिचुएशन में नहीं है करेक्ट यू कैन नॉट कंपेयर यूएस विद अफगानिस्तान द कंडीशंस प्रीवेलेंट इन यूएस इज नॉट द सेम इन अफगानिस्तान यू कैन नॉट कंपेयर यूके विद नाइजीरिया लाइक दैट एवरी कंट्री इट विल हैव इट्स ओन सोशियो इकोनॉमिक सिचुएशन इट विल हैव इट्स ओन रिस्क सो फॉर द पर्पस ऑफ यू नो प्रोफाइलिंग आवर एनआरआईस एलआईसी हैज क्रिएटेड फाइव रेसिडेंस ग्रुप and a a k group may some countries they have included so why they have done that if we are going to canvas policy with customers depending on their residence group lac rules dalte hai residence group mein one mein hai to aap ye policy de sakte hai residence group two mein hai to ye de sakte hai residence group five mein hai to bahut acha you can give anything like that lac has profile and the basic reason behind that profiling is because of the different risk situation existing in different countries right agar bharat mein hai to agar whether you are in uh, pune or in chennai kuch farak hi nahi hai same rules in our country but outside india depending on which residence group you are so in order to master nra insurance you need to first know what are the resident group classifications given by lic mera customer kahan baithte hai उनको क्या क्या पॉलिसी में दे सकता हूँ कितना मिनिमम समर शूट दे सकता हूँ कितना मैक्सिमम दे सकता हूँ वेदर ये प्लान उनको दे सकता हूँ या ना नाउ यू टेल मी विदाउट नोइंग ऑल दिस थिंग्स हाउ यू विल बी गेटिंग कॉन्फिडेंस टू अप्रोच एन एन आर आई दैट इज वाई द बेसिक नॉलेज बहुत बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर एनी प्रोफेशनल राइट फाइव रेसिडेंस ग्रुप सर्विंग फॉर्म different underwriting yardstick have been adopted for different residents group obviously kyunki sabhi country same nahi hai har country mein har cheez hota hai it is different the risk perception is different we cannot treat a person uh, in afghanistan the same as a person as a person who is in us so that threat risk perception we are dealing with uh, you know lives where a huge amount of risk is there so iske liye different different yardstick some adopt karte hai residents extra is charged for some of the residents group this is an important thing you all would have heard about age extra you would have heard about occupation extra there is something called as residents extra agar ye group mein hai to a disturbed country se uske liye we need to put extra premium that is called as residents extra by virtue of people living presently in that country residents extra right agar aapko ye pata chala ki you can very easily uh, approach the customer quoting the premium with residence extra itself plan restrictions also imposed for clients residing in some residence group maine pehle hi bola tha ki sabhi countries mein rehne wale nra fni usko same treatment hum nahi de sakte farak hona chahiye to protect our institutions interest we need to have a clear demarcation we need to have a clear segregation of the countries उसके लिए हर ग्रुप के लिए अलग अलग रूल्स होता है यार उन जस्ट डोंट नोट इट ऑन ऑल द नेम्स अगर ये नोट किया तो यू विल नॉट अंडरस्टैंड द सब्जेक्ट फर्स्ट लिसन टू मी ये पीपीटी आईएस साहब एंड आसर साहब विल शेयर इट इन योर ग्रुप्स सो माय पीपीटी इज ऑलरेडी अवेलेबल एवरीवेयर इन दैट पीपीटी यू कैन टेक अ प्रिंट आउट आपके हाथ पे रख सकते हैं डोंट राइट ऑल दिस चार्ट्स जो चीज हम बोलते हैं लिखने के लिए सिर्फ वो नोट कीजिए राइट so these 18 countries are grouped under residence group 1 you can see afghanistan burundi chad Chechen Republic, Democratic Republic of Congo, Haiti, Iran, Iraq. Yeah, these names we have heard. There are some countries we would have not heard, but still, the eighteen countries are grouped as 
रेसिडेंस ग्रुप वन ठीक है आवर कस्टमर इज रिसाइडिंग इन रेसिडेंस ग्रुप वन यू हैव योर रिलेटिव रिसाइडिंग इन एनी ऑफ द रेसिडेंट ग्रुप वन ही इज वेरी वेल्थी उनके पास बहुत सारा पैसा है अगर आप पूछा तो जरूर वो पॉलिसी लेंगे बट यू नीड टू नो वॉट इज द रूल दट अप्लाइस ब्लाइंडली आप जीवन उमंग नाइन फोर्टी फाइव वन करोड़ के लिए पचास लाख के लिए उनके पास नहीं पूछ सकते राइट सो यू हैव फर्स्ट नोन दट ही रिजाइड इन रेसिडेंस ग्रुप वन रेसिडेंस ग्रुप वन में क्या रूल है क्या क्या प्लान हम दे सकते हैं उस प्लान में कितना समर शूट तक हम दे सकते हैं If you are going to know all these things, your approach, your pre-approach, approach, plan presentation, everything will lead to wonderful business. Rules are the basement for the business plans. Rules are important. Marketing is important, equally important. Rules. Let us see what is there for residents group one. Only J endowment type single premium only allowed. Atam. That means. You cannot canvas a regular premium plan if your customer is residing in residence group one. What are the endowment type single premium? You will obviously know nine seventeen single premium endowment. There is another plan called nine sixteen. Correct? So nine sixteen, what is it? It is a bima budget. We know bima budget is a money back type of plan, but still, be for classification purpose, even a money back has its root in endowment only. Only difference between money back and endowment is endowment type. फाइनल में हम मेच्योरिटी देंगे मनी बैक में तीन साल पहले आई मीन एवरी थ्री इयर्स एवरी फाइव इयर्स वी गिव इट दैट्स इट सो बीमा बचत इज आल्सो इंक्लूडेड इन दिस एंडोवमेंट टाइप सिंगल प्रीमियम आजकल बहुत सारा नॉन पार प्लान्स लॉन्च हो रहा है ना देन 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 ऑल दिस टर्मिनोलॉजी हम लोगों को बहुत कंफ्यूजन होता है करेक्ट एक प्लान हम मेमोराइज करने से पहले दूसरा नॉन पार प्लान आ रहा है so in these non par plans aapko track pe lena chahiye what are all the plans i can give to nrs endowment type single premium only allowed what can be given to residents group 1 then 866 dhan varsha can be given dhan varsha mein option 1 can be given option 2 nahi right likewise you need to how you will come to know whether a new plan mein can i i can be given to this resident group or not iske liye main bola tha ki aapko circulars padhna ek bahut important uh, kaam uh, rakhna chahiye whenever a new plan comes obviously your dos sbs abm bm will be sending you the marketing input but marketing alone nahi chalta aap logon ko samajh mein hona chahiye what are the basic rules Especially, आप एनआर बिजनेस में वेंचर करना चाहते हैं तो पूरा रूल्स आपको समझ में होना चाहिए That plan is not allowed because it is giving 1.25 times the summer show. The difference between Dhan Varsha and Dhan Rekha is Dhan Varsha me it was 1.25 times of the tabular premium, so it was not considered as a high risk plan. Option one, option two, ten times of the tabular premium. That's why ah, us me option one and they can get whereas. In uh, this uh, Dhan Rekha 863, it is 1.25 times of the basic sum assured. If basic sum assured is 10 lakhs, 1.25 times becomes 12 lakh 50 thousand. So we cannot give a plan, a single premium plan, to this residence group one, which is having a higher death cover element. Right? You need not remember all these things. आपको सिर्फ ये चीज करना चाहिए कि नया प्लान आया तो नया प्लान का अंडरटिंग रूल्स क्या बोलता है स्पेशली एनआर एन एफ एन आईओ में हम किसको दे सकते हैं किसको नहीं दे सकते हैं एंड वॉट ऑप्शन वी कैन गिव ये सब आपको डेयरी में लिखना चाहिए रीडिंग इज अ कंटिन्यूस एक्सरसाइज यार ऑफ दर इज नो एंड पॉइंट टू रीडिंग यू हैव टू कीप ऑन रीडिंग टिल यू आर दैर इन दर्थ राइट एंड ऑल द मोर वी आर इन प्रोफेशन ऑफ life insurance as long as we call ourselves as agents we need to be updated so keep on reading higher death cover single premium plan not allowed no residence extra charged is group me kyon residence extra nahi 
चार्ज करते हैं ऑलरेडी वी आर सेलेक्टिव वी आर नॉट गिविंग एनी रेगुलर प्रीमियम प्लान है ना हम सिर्फ सिंगल प्रीमियम एंटोमेंट दे सकते हैं इसके ऊपर रेसिडेंस एक्स्ट्रा हम नहीं डालते दिस इज द लॉजिक वाई फॉर ग्रुप 1 देयर इज नो रेसिडेंस एक्स्ट्रा जो प्रीमियम होता है सिर्फ वही प्रीमियम हमको अलग करना चाहिए राइट right? मैक्सिमम टर्म अलाउड इज 15 इयर्स आप किसी भी प्लान दे दो इसके अंदर बट उनका मैक्सिमम टर्म 15 साल के ऊपर नहीं चलना चाहिए टेक केयर ऑफ दिस एस्पेक्ट एंड मैक्सिमम सम शुड नीड्स टू बी 10 लाख ओनली दीस आर ऑल वेल एस्टैब्लिश्ड रूल्स यार LIC will not uh, you know relax all these rules these, these are all well established rules iske andar hi humko operate karna chahiye so without knowing these things your marketing will be useless marketing will be highly purposeful and productive provided wo rules ke saath 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 chalta hai then only it will be a successful initiative so maximum summer shoot is 10 lakhs pension products without life cover allowed hamare paas kya kya pension products hai हम लोग ये नहीं बोल सकते 857 जीवन अक्षय करेक्ट यू कैन गिव जीवन अक्षय यू कैन गिव फॉर एनआरआईस एज़ वेल एज़ एफएनआई वाज नो टेंशन 858 मोस्ट पॉपुलर जीवन शांति जीवन शांति विद लाइफ कवर या विदाउट लाइफ कवर ये सवाल होता है करेक्ट जीवन अक्षय में लाइफ कवर नहीं है सो सीधा आप दे सकते हैं टू रेसिडेंस ग्रुप 1 ग्रुप 2 ग्रुप 3 एनी ग्रुप जीवन अक्षय नो टेंशन नो टेंशन प्लान जीवन शांति वो रिस्कवर के साथ होता है या ना यू विल नो दैट जीवन शांति द डेथ बेनिफिट मिनिमम डेथ बेनिफिट प्लस 105 परसेंट करेक्ट सो 5 परसेंट तो दैट 5 परसेंट प्रॉबेबली हम लेते हैं कि इट इज अ रिस्क प्लान सो व्हाट वी हैव डन इज फॉर ग्रुप वन टू ग्रुप फोर फर्स्ट लेट्स सी ग्रुप वन ग्रुप वन में जो रहता है वी विल गिव ओनली विथ अ मैक्सिमम डेफरमेंट ऑफ फाइव ईयर्स right maximum deferment of 5 years then what is the other pension plan saral pension 862 uske liye kuch risk aur nahi hai seedha hum de sakte hai like that if our customer is there in residence group 1 your first job is to write down what are all the products i can give here it is very very clear that hum sirf single premium endowment ya yeah, this money back bima bachat de sakte hai and uh, this uh, jeevan varsha option 1 de sakte hai Likewise, in future, whatever new plan is launched, I repeat at the cost of repetition. You can give the NRA or the NIO. Be sure or not. This you have to note. Because you will not know when you will get opportunity. Opportunity to get is when you have to alert. You have to get opportunity to get the opportunity. You should not scout for the rules and other things. Always keep updated. Then only uh, your performance will be extraordinary. Residence group two. Residence group two. Me, how many countries have we classified? Thirty nine countries. Thirty nine countries are there. Angola, Armenia, Azerbaijan, uh, this uh, Bangladesh, etc., etc. Ethiopia. So many names are there. Thirty nine countries are there. Right? See, the page runs to second slide. Right? So definitely take a print out of this PPT. I am sure we will be sending it uh, through your groups. Up. आपके पास एक प्रिंट आउट रख दीजिए सो देट यू कैन आइडेंटिफाई माय एनआरए रिलेटिव माय एनआरए फ्रेंड इज रिसाइडिंग इन दिस कंट्री वो किस ग्रुप के अंदर आता है आपको समझ में होना चाहिए एट द टाइम यू शुड नॉट बी आस्किंग एनीबॉडी सेल्फ हेल्प इज ऑलवेज द बेस्ट कीप कॉपी ऑफ द सर्टिफिकेट्स राइट प्रेसिडेंट ग्रुप 2 में क्या रूल हम बोलते हैं देयर आल्सो एंडोवमेंट टाइप सिंगल प्रीमियम अलोन अलाउड फिनिश You cannot think of any other regular premium plan. Group one ka kya primary rule hai? Group two ma bhi same rule is followed. Higher death cover single premium plans not allowed. Yahan bhi, yahan bhi. Then reka you cannot give. Then varsha you can give option one. No residence extra charge in this residence group two also. Here also the maximum term is fifteen years. But the maximum sum assured you can give up to twenty five lakhs. Its ka arth kya hai? Residence group one se residence group two thoda better hai LIC ke angko mein. Correct? Isliye waha ham ten lakh restrict kiya. Yaha ham achis lakh tak dete hain. Or residence group two only endowment type single premium and all the plans which are coming in this direction. 
Here also pension products without life cover will be allowed. Whatever rule, many bala group one may resident group one may hana Jeevan Akshay, Jeevan Shanti, and uh, Saral pension. Jeevan Shanti may maximum deferment five sal. Go, yeah, right. Then residence group three. Is may sir kitana country say yeg do teen char panch ya saat. Only seven countries are there in this residence group three. Amoros, Lebanon, Nicaragua, Niger, Nigeria. Okay, I'm from Nigeria. Pata hai. What is this Nigeria within bracket HAV? They say Nami Nayana. What is this Nigeria within bracket HAV? The nomenclature like that. The country is called as Nigeria. So, why we have categorized this as HAV? You need to understand. These are the countries which are having high incidence of this disease. You will know that if a customer is having an HIV, un logon ko hum policy nahi de sakte. Correct? So, jo jo NRIs is country ke andar rete hai, unko hum policy de sakte hai, but they have to necessarily submit a HIV negative report. Uske liye LAC ni ye likha hai. Niger HIV, Nigeria HIV. That means, should we will see in the next slide. But with HIV report only. HIV Likato Sirp HIV negative report, then it's not enough. Any special reports has to be accompanied with the basic MER medical report. Right? So in Logan Co. If HIV, it is written, you need to understand that non-medical concession is me nahi hai. Aapko basic MER dena chahiye. HIV report has to be submitted with the basic MER of the medical examiner. Thik hai. Ye seven countries resident group three me LIC ka rules kya bota hai. Residence extra of three per thousand summer show. If they are residing in any of these seven countries, un logon ko we need to collect three per thousand summer sure. You have to multiply depending on the summer sure. Three per summer sure, we need to collect as extra premium. A resident Indian ko kitana premium of collect karte on seeing the app. For these people in residence group three, you need to collect three rupees more per thousand summer sure. That means for a lakh, it will be 300. Right? For 10 lakhs, it will be 3,000. Like that, you have to multiply and collect extra premium. Agar quarterly mode hai to, yearly ko convert karna, uske baad divided by 4. Half a hai to, yearly ko calculate karna, uske baad it will be, I say. Maximum rate of summer should 150 lakhs only. So, residence group 3 is giving us more opportunities. Jo residence group 1 or 2 may jitna restriction tha ki hum sirf single premium endowmenty bet sakte hai and our annuity plan without life cover sirf jitna restrictions tha but residence group 3 may you can give products majority of the products you can give but uska restriction maximum 1.5 crores hona chahiye bahut acha hai humko 50 lakh mile to bhi bahut acha hoga na lc has given 150 lakhs 1.5 crores tak you can go for people residing in residence group 3. HIV report needed for some countries. I have told in the slide why it is needed. That reason also I have told. Right? To ensure our customers are very genuine. If they are genuine or ingenuine, what? How we will come to know? Only based on the reports. Right? Pure term plan not allowed for such people who are residing in residence group 3. Term rider also LIC may be there. Right. Term rider we are not giving to resident Indians. Then only the question of giving term rider to NRIs. So term rider is not allowed. PWB rider also not allowed. This residence group 3 may Amara NRIs FNI was right there. Unke bal bachi ke upar agar policy liya. So that premium waiver benefit also is not given to the policy holders who are residing in this residence group 3. Then agar amne single premium Plan, PCB single premium plan, so for this group, residence extra is not charging. Residence extra is only for regular premium plan. 
ग्रुप थ्री के लिए थ्री रुपीज याद रखना वेरी इजी टू रिमेम्बर ग्रुप थ्री के लिए थ्री रुपीज एक्स्ट्रा राइट फॉर सिंगल प्रीमियम नो रेसिडेंस एक्स्ट्रा दिस इज ऑल अबाउट रेसिडेंस ग्रुप the first we saw residents group 1 18 countries were there residents group 3 we saw 39 countries residents group 3 we saw seven countries right now residents group 4 ye bahut bada group hai with 53 countries are there some of our customers will certainly be in any of these groups south africa is a famous place all these things we will know right you can see the complete list of the residence group 4 so residence group 4 ke liye kya rule hota hai we need to understand we are going to 2.5 crores what does this signify residence group 3 is a residence group 4 is better to lic is better for insurance uske liye waha we put a residence extra of 3 here we are imposing a lower residence extra of only 2 rupees per thousand and maximum rated up summer shoot group 3 mein humne uh, kitna diya 1.5 crores here we can give up to 2.5 crores right Here also pure term not allowed, term rider also not allowed, premium waiver benefit, all the policies on the life of children will be not allowed. करते for group four people, no residence extra for single premium plans. So I have told you before that five residence group we have covered a majority of it. We have seen one, two, three, four. Now we are coming to the classic residence group, residence group five. उसमें 121 कंट्रीज इस ग्रुप के अंदर है 121 कंट्रीज 100 परसेंट वी विल हैव फ्रेंड्स रिलेटिव्स एक्वेंटेंसेस कस्टमर्स इन एनी ऑफ दिस 121 कंट्रीज आपका इंटेंशन मेरा कस्टमर से मैं कैसे पॉलिसी ले सकता हूँ ही इज़ रेडिंग इन दिस कंपनी दिस कंट्री ही इज़ रेडिंग ही इज़ वर्किंग इन दिस कंपनी हिस वो भारत आने वाला है अगले अगला मंथ ही इज प्रेजेंटली देयर ही विल नॉट कम फॉर 6 मंथ्स मैं कैसे पॉलिसी उनसे कैनवास करता हूं व्हाट इज द रूल मेडिकल आएगा या ना आएगा इफ ही कम्स टू इंडिया अदर मेडिकल है या ना है अगर ये चीज आपको पता चला कि देन यू आर गोइंग टू रॉक माय डियर फ्रेंड्स नोबडी नीड्स टू टीच यू 9149369485 ये सब चीज में आप बहुत अच्छा काम करते हैं यू ऑल नो व्हाट इज मार्केटिंग यू ऑल नो व्हाट आर द प्लान्स बट यू are not aware about the rules of nri the rules humko pata chala ki hamara marketing ka knowledge plus this rules ka knowledge ek sath it will really work wonders leading you to mdrt right residence group 5 me 121 countries are there almost all the countries almost all the countries more than 50% of the countries are grouped in this so what are the rules for residence group 5 Almost all plans can be given, except few, except few. Almost all the plans. Let's see. Me, jitna plan hai, thirty five plans, or thirty six plans, or thirty four, whatever it is. Everything can be given, excepting a few. Iska arth ye hota hai ki jo jo customers ye hundred and twenty one residents group ke andar baithe hai, un logon ko resident Indians ki tarah. At par LAC is treating. This is what you need to understand. Because this residence group is very comfortable zone. Hai, un logon ko, uh, they can be treated at par with the Indians as such resident Indians. So almost all the plans except few can be given. What are those except few? You will be knowing for NRI some plan cannot be given like cancer cover. For FNIO some plan cannot be given like. जीवन शिरोमणि नया प्लान भी आया ना जीवन आसाद वो नहीं दे सकते विद वन और फ्यू एक्सेप्शंस तो हाउ यू कैन कीप ट्रैक ऑफ द एक्सेप्शंस जो जो नया प्लान आ रहे हैं उसका सर्कुलर आपको मांगना पड़ेगा आपको नोट करना चाहिए दिस इज व्हाट आई बीन रीटरेटिंग अगेन एंड अगेन इन माय सेशन नो रेसिडेंस एक्स्ट्रा पक्का व्हाई दैट ग्रुप इज फैंटास्टिक ग्रुप 
the political situation, the socio-economic situation, sabhi bahut acha hai, amare bharat ki tara, to unka residence extra ka zarurati hai. That is what LIC means. Un logon ko hum sabhi riders de sakte hai, except CIR. AB you can give. Mene AB bola to, aapko samajh mein hona chahiye ki AB and DB also is included in AB. Term rider hum de sakte hai. BWB rider can be given to proposer for the policies on their children allowed the nris and fnios clear cir alone not allowed and of course many pele bola cancer cover is not allowed to nris and fnios of resident group five i have prepared a one page ready recognized in the next slide Apo ek slide may if you are going to have that handy you need not go through the ppt her bar uh, mind ko confuse nahi karna chahiye seedha you can see it here Yes, friends. This is how it goes. Residence group one may 18 countries are there. Residence extra nahi hota hai. Eligible plans 916, 917 and jo bola, this uh, Adhan Varsha and all the other new plans which are going to come, you need to watch. That can be accommodated and it can be given. Maximum term is uh, 15 years and maximum summer should is 10 lakhs. Right? For residence group two, this may 39 countries hai, residence extra, yahan bhi nil hai, the same set of plans what you can give for residence group one, you can give to them also. This may be maximum term 15 hai, but yahan instead of 10, we can give up to 25 lakhs. Residence group three may 7 hai, this may ek or cheez amne dekha ki some countries are having HIV within bracket with the name. Aapko samaj mein hona chahiye ki us country mein agar mera customer hai to, उनका जरूर एमआर देना चाहिए चाहिए और ये भी एचएवी का रिपोर्ट राइट रेसिडेंस एक्स्ट्रा इट इज 3 पर 1000 समर शूट ऑल प्लान्स एक्सेप्ट टर्म एंड कैंसर कवर मैक्सिमम टर्म का रिस्ट्रिक्शन कुछ भी नहीं होता एंड यू कैन गो अप टू 150 लाख 1.5 वर्स नेक्स्ट कम्स रेसिडेंस ग्रुप 4 रिलेटिवली बेटर देन रेसिडेंस ग्रुप 3 टू अस 53 countries are there. Usme residence extra per thousand summer should up for 2 rupees dalna chahiye. Ye 2 rupees also, it's only for regular premium plans, single premium ke liye nahi hai. And all plans except term and cancer cover can be given. Maximum term restrictions nahi hai. 3 and 4 mein. Yaha maximum term restriction hai. 15 saal ke upar hum nahi de sakte. Here there is no maximum term restriction. Here it was 1.5 crores. Here it is 2.5 crores. Next comes the greenish pasture group, residence group 5, where 121 countries are accommodated, 121 parts are accommodated, parts of the countries are accommodated. If you have done the total, the UN, uh, UN ka list, which I have said, will come to 210, uske upar aega, then you might wonder, sir said only 210. If we have done the total, kiya to, uh, it will be more than that. Uh, why that confusion? Hai? There are certain groups, may in some countries, uh, one part will be under residence group 5, another part will be under residence group 4. It all depends upon the geographical location, correct? Hope you understand. Some parts of the country will be in different groups, some other will be in different residence groups. Put together only these many countries are coming. This is the 18 different different countries, 39 different different countries, 53 different different countries. Some part will be there, some part will be there. Right? So here, there is no residence extra. All plans except Cancer cover and some other plans which I have told for FNIOs, which is some naive sector. Maximum term nahi hai, maximum coverage, no limit. It is based on the income earning capacity as per the financial underwriting rule. 35 ke under hai to 30 times. 36 to 45 hai to ye. Ye sub rules aapko samaj mein hona chahiye. Financial underwriting to what level I can give. Right? Good. So you take a printout of this and keep it handy with you. That will immediately give you an idea. Okay, my uh, customer is here. They can give me this plan. De sakte hai. I say you can come to a conclusion. And once you are going through all these things, I tell you, friends, you will become masters of NRI in the first instance, right? I have known what are all the residents do. Us cheez mein kitna countries hota hai, kya kya countries hota hai, uska rules kya hota hai, Kya kya plan am de sakte, kya kya plan am nahi de sakte, what is the maximum limit? A sub one page ready reckoner is for your use. Right. Next slide. What is mail order? 
million dollar question, right? If it is a question answer session, I can ask questions, but I need to finish by 9.15 as said by ISR, right? So another half an hour or probably 40 minutes we have time, we'll complete it. What is mail order? Getting business when life assured is outside India is called as mail order. Simple, simple definition. Simple. Our customer he is not present within the territorial jurisdiction of India while signing the proposal. Usko hum mail order bolte hai. A, first, a person who is signing the proposal outside India. Yaha aapko do cheese uh, mind me aega. Person outside India means he can send business from abroad or US agent can visit the country and also get business. Correct. There are many, many, many agents in LIC who take a tour to different countries where customers are there and they are going to get bulk business and completing MDRT, double MDRT, TOT. This should be the thought process of all agents. This should be the thought process. Once you are thorough with the rules, there won't be any hesitation on your part. If you are going to get five customers at a single place, you can definitely pay a visit to Singapore, or Malaysia, where visa is very easy to get, correct? Unlike in US, where you have to wait for 9.99 days. You identify those countries which are nearer to us. And you can definitely make a visit. So here, mail order may, if the customer is present within India, it is a regular business. If he is outside India, whether Agent is in India and getting business through mail or agent is visiting abroad. That is also called as mail order. Be very clear. Agent may visit the country and do the process. OB mail order can very hata hai. The point here is that whether the customer signs the proposal within India or outside India. This is what is called as mail order. Some people are thinking that if agent goes abroad to get proposal, it is not mail. No, 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 no. Yaha sign nahi hua to, that is called as mail order. Whether you receive it by courier or whether you go over there to complete it is called as mail order. Here only the signature ka mamla hai. Signing within India, signing outside India. Okay. Agent may canvas from India. Yes, obviously. Many of you are not in a position to go abroad. So you are canvassing from here. Life should complete formality outside Indian soil. That is mail order. You are sending a proposal. He is completing all the formalities outside India. Right? That is mail order. In short, proposal signed abroad is mail order. Yad rakna, friends. Be clear, 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 crystal clear about what is a mail order. Proposal signed abroad is called as mail order. Right? Who are all eligible for mail order? Abhi pata chala anko ki what is a mail order? Then who are all eligible? Whom I can approach? What residence group? What are the rules? If we are going to know about this, then there is no stopping at all. NRA of residence group, five countries alone are eligible for mail order. Very, very important point. Don't disturb people in residence group one to four. You cannot get mail order business. They have to necessarily come to India. At that point of time only you can canvas for business. You can canvas and keep it ready, but you can complete it. Agar wo yaha aaye ke baad, only you can Completed, right? NRA of residence group 5. FNIOs of residence group 5 are also eligible provided they hold a overseas citizen of India card given by government of India. Earlier in the beginning, I told that that uh, NB and R314 many circular bolana. There they gave concession that mail order can be done for FNIOs also. Earlier the rule was. FNI was called mail order bandita. So LAC has relaxed to these rules. Whatever rules LAC agar relax karte hai, usko hamare faida ke liye humko use karna padega. Then only there is a purpose of getting the relaxation. Good. So FNI wo ko business dene ke liye primary condition hai. If you come to know that they are they are uh, FNI wo, the very first thing you have to ask is, do you have a OCI card? If they have a OCI card, proceed. If they do not have a OCI card, don't waste your time. Right? You will be canvassing the policy, you will be giving the premium completion case. OCI card, they will reject the case. 
question where we went wrong. Only we are to be blamed. The LIC is not to be blamed. Rules are there. We have to learn. The interest to learn things, the interest to know the rules has to start from within. I hope with this clear example, you have understood the importance of knowing uh, and staying updated with the latest rules. FNIO ke liye OCI card bohati zarurat hai. Children of NRI FNIO residing in group by countries. They can also be given mail order. Earlier, it was not possible and slowly they are relaxing. Children, if, if a person uh, is residing in US, his son is also in US, you can give uh, this uh, children's money back or Jeevan Umang or uh, this um, whatever it is, Jeevan Lab or whatever it is. So you can give to the children also through mail order provided they are in residence group. Why? Housewife, this is yet another relaxation. Even housewives ke liye a mail order business de sakte hai provided they are a part of residence group. Why? Right? Then what is the procedure for mail order? How am I to do mail order? Here there are two things as I have told in the last two slides. Sir. Mail order is nothing but agent visiting the country to meet the customer or agent canvassing from India. Correct? This may up to clear on a chayeki. Customer is not in India, so uska naam mail order bolte LIC. If he is not here, it is a mail order. So, ye do cheese up kar sakte hai. You can go to the country to get it signed. And when he comes over, or rather when he is abroad, you are canvassing from here through WhatsApp, mail. Ye do no cheese mail order ke andar hota hai. Now, if you understand what is the rule for this, what is the rule for this, then it will be akka for you. You will not do any kind of a flaw. A cheese I am going to tell you now. Agent visiting the country. Kya hota hai? What is the rule? Agent canvassing from India. Agent visiting the country. Akka. Non-medical concessions clearly apply. As I have told you, preferred non-medical is applicable for NRIs and FNIOs. Special non-medical is applicable only for con NRIs. Clear, clear, clear note karna. Special non-medical is not there for FNIOs. Right? It is there only for NRIs. A court cheese is me. Uh, non-medical may, there is something else called as general non-medical. Correct? Earlier days we used to call as NMG, non-medical general. Abhi LS ne kya kya wo last word ko pehle mar diya. General non-medical instead of non-medical general. Understand? NRIs and FNIOs do not have general non-medical concession. Be very, 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 very clear. NRIs and FNIOs ko preferred hai. Sirf NRI ko special hai. NRI FNIO ko general non-medical nahi hai. Right? Note it down in a notepad. General non-medical is not applicable. So, bolte hai na 12 lakhs, 8 lakhs and 5 lakhs. General condition for uh, people uh, for uh, lower profile people, those who are uh, normally educated, working in a small company, earning a small money. So, un logo ko hum general non-medical ke andar lete hai na? For uh, NRIs and FNIOs, general non-medical is not there. So, when agent is visiting the country, non-medical concessions would, ap would, apply, uh, would apply provided that customer is eligible under preferred. Preferred ke liye kya bola? They need to have 10 lakhs INR income. That is what is important, graduate. Correct? Special ke liye mani kya bola? Employed people ke liye 2.5 lakhs INR. Right? But this may ek cheez sanko dhyan mein rakna chahiye ki when you are getting a business, obviously 99 out of 100 people will come under preferred category. Correct? 10 lakhs in Indian currency is nothing for anybody working abroad. So majority of the people will come under Preferred. Jo rule resident Indians ko hai. The same rule applies to them also. As far as income is concerned, as far as other things are concerned. So when you are going to visit the country, you are going to Gulf to get policy. UAE or somewhere. Iska arth kya hota hai ki? It is as good as the customer visiting India and doing business. If the customer is visiting India, I have already said that what is the resident Indian non-medical rule preferred or special apply? Hota hai, that applies to 
NRIs and FNI was also. And if you the same thing, if you are going to go over there, it will be a cakewalk for you without any medical up to the limits available. Oh, limits, itna hai, aapko for circular dekna padega, NB under 333, NB under 336, NB under 349. दे के आपके नोट पे लिखना चाहिए ठीक है 35 के अंदर है क्या टोटली अप टू 1 करोड़ आई कैन गिव विद वीएमई यार 36 टू 45 क्या आई कैन गिव अप टू 50 लाख आई विल शो द स्लाइड्स फॉर योर इजी अंडरस्टैंडिंग राइट सो नॉन मेडिकल कंसेशन शुड अप्लाई इट इज जस्ट द सेम एज इफ द लाइफ ऑफ शुड इज इन इंडिया इफ ही इज विजिटिंग इंडिया वो कितना आसान है पॉलिसी कंप्लीशन द सेम वे इफ यू आर गोइंग टू गो ओवर देयर टू कंप्लीट द पॉलिसी अभी सोच लीजिए यारों, is it not worth to go over to any country, nearby country to get huge volume of business क्योंकि same rules apply होता है, so it is really worth a small flight fare, it it will be definitely worth to bring a premium in lakhs, right? You analyze the cost benefit ratio and I need not tell you, you people are all experts, you have to be experts in that, decide on that. The rule says if you are going to visit the country, then it will be a hassle-free completion, non-medical limits. Agar aap jate hai to, up to how much you can canvas, that selling tip I am going to tell you, that rule I am going to tell you, you can mark it down in your dairy, and that should be your agenda. I am going to canvas to this level. I know there will be no tension. That we are going to see. Agent to inform LIC in writing with this visa copy. Procedurally, if you are planning to go abroad for canvassing, you need to either give a physical letter to your branch manager stating your intention that I am going to visit so and so country and I will be staying over there. This is my visa copy. This, these are all my passport copy. I am going to canvass over there. A permission in writing. Go zarur denge. Right? That you have to do it. You can even send by mail also to them. Usual underwriting rules and hassle free completion. If you are visiting the country, friends, it is really a worthy visit, I should say. If you are going to go, the rules are the same, and naturally, you can take an attempt on that. And here I go. What is the maximum limit? If NRA is in India or agent is visiting abroad, please note it down, my dear friends. If the customer is between 18 to 35, Maximum of a crore that you can give. One crore. One crore that you can give. This is not based on some should. That is based on some under consideration, which many of you will be knowing. Jeevan Anand, 1.25 times. Money back, 1.25 times. Hima Shri, 1.25 times. Like that. Up to one crore you can give with VMER. VMER, ye kya hota hai? That is a recent initiative which all of you will be knowing by LIC, whereby a doctor will be speaking over to our customers with prior appointment and getting to know all the details that is otherwise available in medical examiner report. All these questions will be asked over video medical. So you can go up to 1 crore. 1 crore is a huge sum assured with a huge premium you know, up to age 35. So, if the customer is in India or if the ASN agent visits abroad, the same rule applies up to 1 crore in this age group. Here, if they are between 36 to 45, you can canvas up to 50 lakhs. This is a huge opening for this age. This is a very huge opening for this age with VMER. This VMER is as good as a non-medical friends. Customer ko sir 5 minute lagega ya 10 minute lagega. You have to submit the proposal. And uh, the TPA will be calling us. If we are abroad, they will send a mail and they will fix the appointment. A doctor, agar Chennai may policy diya to, doctor will be from Telangana. Agar Telangana may policy submit kiya to, doctor will be from Pune. Agar Pune may policy submit kiya to, doctor will be from Delhi. What is your problem in that? They are going to speak in English. And all appointments are very well laid down and they ask even the language of preference. They also ask through what instrument you are going to log in for this video medical, whether it's a notepad, whether it's a laptop, whether it's an iPhone, they fix appointment. And it's a hassle free completion, one crore with VMER, 50 lakhs with VMER. For this age group, 46 to 50 years, you can get 
20 lakhs with just an ordinary VMER. Why I am again and again stating this as VMER is special reports bohot mushkil hota hai, friends, to get it abroad, correct? Especially in countries like US and others, the charges are also exorbitant to get the report. So, samasdari karke, what you need to do is you need to clearly target the summer short, which is going to give you hassle-free completion unless the customer is very well aware of the rules and is ready to cooperate with all the medical. Then in that case, you can go for higher summer short. Otherwise, you need to know this is the maximum which can ensure hassle-free completion for me. Right? So, 46 to 50 ke liye, 20 lakhs. I hope you all have jotted it down in the paper. I repeat it at the cost of repetition. If the NRA is in India or if the agent visits abroad, these are all the maximum limits which can be completed with just video medical and nothing more than that. Right? Next comes the important question. Agent is canvassing from India. I said that this is also in mail order. Because proposer agar bharat ke andar sign nahi kiya to it is mail order whether you go over there or uh, you canvas from here doesn't matter agent canvassing from india form 300 nra covid questionnaire to be sent me mail yeah covid questionnaire mein very frequently they are changing the versions don't send version number seven or version number six in that case you will be outdated and lic will be asking you revised version right keep abreast of the latest rules covid version nine I say, whatever it is, whatever be the number 9 or 8 or 10, whatever is the latest, that you need to send by mail to the customer. Life Assured has to fill the same and get it witnessed. Here it's very clear. Some of our people, you know, by practice, Dubai ko paper yahan se bejte hai. And customer will fill up or he will just sign and send it there. Yahan pura details fill up karke signature ke paas se hum signature marte hain are customer is there in dubai he is signing there how you sitting in pune or you sitting in chennai can witness it it has to be witnessed by a person because it cannot be dated at pune or it cannot be dated at chennai here it is dated at dubai so obviously witness has to be done by a person who is presently in that country of residence lic has given huge relaxations Huge relaxations in that regard through that uh, NB and R314. When I said, what is relaxation? Witness can be an NRI or an FNIO friend with the local address proof. What is that? Before the introduction of that uh, NB and R314, you know, how many headaches are there to get it witnessed? Who will go to the witness? Go to the embassy, get it from the Consulate officer, unka kaam sit ye hai kya? Go to the bank, go to the employer. Itna stringent rules tha. Those customers who are prepared to take policy, ye procedures dekke wo drop karte the. I do not want all those nuisances. Let me come over to India. At the time me lete hai. Like this they will say. But after six months when they come to India, they will say I have changed my plans. Hamko yaha Pune pe yaha. Uh, 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 guest house karitna hai, yaha land karitna hai, yaha ye karna hai, wo karna hai. We are going to, we were losing our business like anything. Now, it can be witnessed by an NRI or an FNI or friend with a local address. Group. Perfect, perfect, perfect. There will be thousands and thousands of friends for the customers, office colleagues who are already NRIs, FNI. We can witness it. Who are in a position to give the local address. Group. It's not relaxation aya to we people need to utilize that relaxation for our betterment. No non-medical concession. Very important. Agar customer comes to India or you are going over there, the non-medical concession will apply. If you are going to canvas from India, non-medical concession nahi hai. Compulsory VMER by our medical service provider. Our TPA jo hota hai na, abhi unko MSP ke naam ke nomenclature change ho gaya. They have to do the video MER. No non-medical concession, even for 10 lakhs. The customer can be preferred category, but he is giving business from US. He is giving business from Dubai. He is giving business from Singapore. Everything will be there. Profile will be super duper, but he is sending business from abroad means LIC needs to have a hold. We are not giving non-medical concession for such people. 
कंपलसरी वीएमईआर मैंने पहले ही बोला कि वीएमईआर इतना बड़ा चीज नहीं है इट विल बी ओवर इन 5 टू 10 मिनट्स ये मेडिकल एग्जामिनर में जो फॉर्म में जो जो सवाल होता है डिड यू हैव एनी डिसीज इन द लास्ट 5 इयर्स डू यू ड्रिंक एंड स्मोक ऑल दोस मामूली सा क्वेश्चंस दे विल बी आस्किंग बेस्ड ऑन द आंसर्स इट विल बी कंप्लीटेड राइट कंपलसरी वीएमईआर बाय आवर एमएसपी इज नीडेड see the next slide for summer shoot limits it just vmer only how much business you can do it how much you can convert that's a very very important slide next slide a special reports case understand friends physical mer is definitely required if the customer is abroad and he is taking a huge insurance he will be requiring special reports correct us special reports aane ka cases ke liye physical mer from a doctor abroad is required earlier the rule was a doctor should be with md degree with 10 years 15 years of experience how our people will go and get the medical if you go to a doctor can a client ask whether you are, you are experienced more than 10 years yes sawal hum nahi puch sakte these were the rules earlier are there now they have relaxed an allopathy doctor can do all those things have come so physical mer from a lab abroad is must for special reports case special reports from lab can be in any format any format in the country no tension at all life is short to send all physical papers by courier to us if you are canvassing from india ye sabhi forms aap unko mail pe bhej sakte hai wo download mar ke he has to fill up all the forms he has to get it witnessed by his nra friend or any other dignitaries whom i'll show in the next slide subsequent slides get the medical if it is more than the allowable some should get the special reports and send the physical papers by courier to us this is also a mail order right here i go friends what is the mail order limit if the agent is in india you are canvassing from here the customer is there yahan dekho 18 to 35 ke liye with vmer you can give only 50 lakhs now try to compare this with the case where agent yaha i mean customer yaha aa raha hai or you are going abroad there it was 1 crore correct friends here it is restricted to 50 lakhs ye you ye rule yaad rakhna nb under 349 mein special reports ka chart 1 and chart 2 aa gaya don't get confused with any other special report chart don't carry four chart eight charts everything will confuse you ultimately you will land up in great trouble you are going to have so many charts just go through this nb and dart 349 you get that special report chart from your branch take a xerox of it take a photo of it that is going to help you so for mail order if agent is canvassing from india your first priority should be to canvass for see the 50 lakh straight away 50 lakhs woman straight away 50 lakhs love pakka no tension at all if they are coming here 1 crore if they are abroad 50 lakhs aapko kya karna chahiye they are abroad husband and wife both are there your intention is to get 1 crore of business husband ko 50 lakhs wife ko 50 lakhs the same premium you are going to get and no tension at all only vmr dono ka and you are going to complete it like that you have to plan and do business 36 to 45 ke liye 30 lakhs tak you can Go with VMER. Forty-six to fifty-five के लिए thirteen lakhs. ये चीज compared to the previous chart. There, if customer is coming here or you are going abroad, I gave the age group as forty-six to fifty ना. Here what I am giving forty-six to fifty-five. Note कीजिए. Every single information is vital. There you see what I give. Ah, here forty-six to fifty. Correct. कितना दिया मैंने? 20 lakhs so why i have not given 46 to 55 here and in the subsequent slide i am giving 46 to 55 is because of the recent special reports revision by lic in nb and r 349 so this age group with ordinary mer you can give up to 13 lakhs so if you are getting customer in this age group you should directly canvas Up to thirteen lakhs, it can be completed effortlessly from here. No tension at all. Witnessed by a person who is a friend of the customer in uh, the foreign country and MER from MSP provider from here. It can be done nowadays. I tell you, friends, the MER is getting 
fast tracked it is coming in less than a day i am experiencing numerous cases like that you have proper coordination with your msp it can come within one day my agent had submitted a proposal by 5 o'clock and he got the call by 7:45 pm um, the medical was over by 8:30 pm and it was sent to branch mail by 10 pm the next day we are completing the proposal that is the speed that is a service which is available we need to utilize that so here 46 to 55 took 13 lakhs so if you see that chart why i have written as 50 is agar 50 ke upar customers aaya to if they are visiting india or you are going abroad 51 to 55 you note it down as 13 lakhs as an additional point 51 to 55 ke liye you note it down as 13 lakhs so this is the only difference here why i write 46 to 50 And why I wrote forty six to fifty five? Same summary. There it is forty six to fifty twenty lakhs, fifty one to fifty five is thirteen lakhs. I hope you have noted down this very important uh, chart and slide which I have given it in the most simplified form, uh, my dear friends. Most simplified form because you people are all marketing people. Zyada um, uh, technical inputs, zyada uh, rules and circulars. आपके सर के अंदर I cannot put it. i should teach you only right i should uh, you know peel off the banana and give it to you i should not give the banana to you and ask you to peel off that is the job of a development officer in sbs we are doing the peeling off and giving it to you but the problem is you people are not eating right okay doesn't matter right next comes the gst exemption for nris and fmios now i have now i have taught you the rules i have taught you what is mail order up to what limit you can go let us see the gst exemption right Sir, sir, another uh, 15 minutes. Can I go, Master Ji? Please continue, sir. Please continue. Yeah, please continue, sir. Yes, yes. GST exemption for NRIs and FNIOs. NRIs and FNIOs can claim GST exemption for NBs and renewals. Renewals also. So many of the agents, DOs and SBS are having doubt that which level of contract, which they have taken four five years back, three years back, two years back. can they claim exemption for the renewal at the time of taking the policy the gst exemption was not there now they are coming for third year fourth year renewal yes you can yes you can you can claim for renewal also check from nre account to be deposited in the lic counter ye bahut bahut important cheez hai yaar yaad rakhna why i am telling this is there have been so many messages doing the rounds in uh, whatsapp breaking news big they breaking news they can directly send the money to lic For GST exemption, वो जरूर money बेच सकते हैं आपको GST exemption नहीं मिलेगा for regular premium plans. LIC has not come out with the official circular or mail in this regard for regular premium plans. Only for single premium plan they are allowing. So as of now, if a customer wants GST exemption in regular premium plan, the remittance has to be by a physical NRE account check to be deposited in our counter. याद रखना To direct credit, all these things may chalega for GST exemption. If they are not particular about GST exemption, let them send it. No problem. I am not much tension in this matter. Right? No other form of remittance eligible for GST exemption. And uh, as I have told you, don't just blindly believe in WhatsApp forwards or uh, Telegram forwards that comes to you. You ensure that you. Such forwards are backed by official circulars or official mails of LIC. Right? After creation, NB department will create NRA master and also URN. Once you are taking a case for NRA, either through mail order or through uh, uh, direct uh, on their visit to India, before uh, uh, you know processing that case, NRA master has to be created in NB department, and you will be getting a URN. that you are in you are has to be used in the cash counter for getting the exemption after creation of you are in remittance to be made in the counter right validity of you are in is 90 days aaj aapne ek you are in create kiya for nri customer so within the next 3 months you can complete the policy up to 5 bocs allowed ye kyun 5 bocs aap aaj canvas kiya 181000 premium aa gaya you had submitted a paper yahan health extra aa gaya what you will do so there has to be a provision for balance of premium uske liye up to 5 bocs is lic has allowed in the same urn right these are all administrative and technical things uh, same procedure to be adopted for renewal premium the only difference is 
when your premium ke liye you are in master will be created by ps department for new business it is created by nb department in some branches it can be interlinked or uh, anybody can do it. that is uh, based on the local adjustments right declaration in annexure 1 to be submitted for nri gst exemption this annexure 1 is available in office you need to take that along with form 300 ab fill up karna chahiye so what are the details that needs to be submitted for nri exemption photocopy of passport all pages visa required residence proof needed residence proof that he is residing in that country some utility bill something needs to be given for single premium gst exemption is available to all modes of payment so i had repeated what i have said for regular premium nr e account check alone needs to be given right for single premium anything is available Present COVID guidelines. Since the year 2020, COVID is not only troubling us uh, outside LIC; it is troubling us inside LIC also. Correct? Har ek mahina, har do mahina, naya 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 circular, naya naya rules hai. Fifteen days ke baad karo, ye karo, ye reject karo, X-ray mango, ye mango. All such things keep coming again and again. So you people need to be abreast of the rules. Aaj ka rule kya hota hai? What is the latest on that? covid guidelines you need to see so what i am going to write here is only based on the latest covid guideline it may change tomorrow right ayer sir had clearly given the disclaimer before the start of the session that is based on the present fact okay nrifnio group 1 to group 5 if they are presently in india allowed as per plan and residential guidelines clear crystal clear if nrifnio is in india no tension at all The earlier rule prior to COVID 2020 से पहले जो रूल होता है अभी वो अप्लाई होगा. You can give the plan and as per the residence guidelines. No tension at all if they are visiting India. Suppose you are going to give your term plan to group five. They should be fully vaccinated. That is a rule, right? ये याद रखना. Because term insurance is very popular with not only resident Indians but also with the NRIs and FNIOs. Eh? They will be asking. So if you are going to give a term plan to NRI in Group Five, you should first ask for COVID vaccination certificate. If uh, they are not having that vaccination certificate, then for NRI the case will not be through. You understand this? You ensure that they are giving the vaccination certificate for your term plan, right? NRIs, FNIOs of Group Five who are presently abroad through mail order, you are going to canvas. Mail order is also allowed as per rules, but pure term plan can be given to NRIs only, not to FNIOs. So these are the present go with COVID guidelines, which are it is subjected to change. Keep track of latest underwriting developments. Now comes income proof and other requirements. Important point. You are successful enough in identifying the customer based on the resident group. You are also uh, successfully canvas the policy. You are getting the check, everything fine. Lacy के लिए क्या submit करना चाहिए? Getting business alone is not success. Getting the policy number is real success for us. Correct. इसके लिए we'll be with better breath. अगर branch का completion है तो we can manage something. अगर division है तो थोड़ा मुश्किल. So Next step, central office. Next step, depending on the some assured SUC, whatever it is. So, what proof we need to collect from NRI customers? For NRIs, same income proof is required as applicable to resident Indian lives. In addition, employment contract, bank statement showing at least three month credit is needed. An important thing. Employment contract is very important for employed people. If the customer runs his own business. Or doesn't have employment contract, this can be waived provided LIC is justified that he is getting an income and some other proof have to be given. Bank statement showing at least three months credit. Here, some customers they would not like to divulge their personal income details. Us cheez me you have to present the case in such a way that jo cheez employment contract me hai. You have to say that it is mentioned here. The customer is not interested to divulge that. If you are going to present that, and if it is recommended by the branch manager, the competent authority may consider waiving it. But don't take it as a rule. Every case has to be dealt on the merits of it, right? 
Don't say that Sridhar sir in the uh, Zoom meeting told that the uh, bank statement is not required. It's a naya. Okay, I don't want to get into any kind of trouble. Making it very clear on a case to case basis, it can be decided provided proper recommendation is there from DM or MM or whatever be the authority for not submitting these details. In addition to income proof NRI questionnaire to be submitted, yes. Photocopy of all pages of passport is must. Here again, some of you are facing problem. Customers will say, why the hell should I give blank pages, man? What purpose? See, why we require blank pages is we need to be sure about the travel activities of the NRI. If he is frequently visiting the disturbed countries, we can treat him as if he is in NRI in residence group. Five. So passport all pages is must, must, and must. You have to convince the customer, tell them that for the travel habits, we need to know for risk profiling, for proper risk identification, we require even the blank pages, sir. Whether it's a 36-page passport or a 60-page passport, doesn't matter. All the pages, blank also needs to be given. Copy of visa. Why I'm telling this again is, if you have successfully canvassed and taken only the first two pages and the last two pages, your policy will not be true. They will ask for all pages. Copy of visa, that is important. Travel and residence questionnaire, that is also important. Travel and residence questionnaire. Why this is important? That is going to say that what are all the countries the customer has traveled. When will LIC call for this travel and residence questionnaire? When you are submitting all passports, all pages of passport, and if LIC comes to see so many stampings, you are a frequent traveler then we want to know what are all the countries you have visited. And here again, if we come to know that you have stayed in a disturbed country between residence group one and two, then if you are there for more than three months, we will not treat you as a residence group five. We will treat you as a residence group one and that residence guideline will apply on you. For that only, this travel and residence questionnaire is required. If the passport pages show frequent stamping. So all these things you should be aware so that you are not putting the customers to unwanted tension. Ek saath pooch lijiye. Ye sabhi documents chahiye. Checklist. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Agar LAC maangne ke baad aap pooche to, he will get irritated. You as a professional should know what are all the rules. Why such a rule? Rules for housewife and minor. Important. Housewife and minors residing in group 5 and group uh, 4 only can be allowed insurance. Be very, 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 very clear. 1, 2, and 3 disallowed. Don't canvas policy. Housewife in 1, 2, and 3. And minors with 1, 2, and 3. Let's see rule clear. When you do a mistake, you are responsible for it. So, housewife and minors can be said group 4 and group 5. Check that. Be very clear about this fact. Medical rules as per manual. Kya rule hota hai? The same rule. Only thing is that I have told you, general non-medical is not there for NRS. So, apko wo preferred ke andar aata hai, wo dekhna hai. Ya special ke andar aata hai, wo dekhna hai. Special also, it's only for NRS, not for FNIOs. Okay? So, it is the same medical rules. HIV report for housewife as per chart. They are in three and four, which you have seen, na? we have to get. For juvenile life, if they are in Nigeria, which is in group four, eh, you need not take for juvenile life. If it is, uh, some assured is up to 50 lakhs. 50 lakhs ke upar only you have to take HIV report for children. For housewife, for any some assured, you have to take HIV report mandatory, just like for husband. Okay? So, rules for housewife, yaad rakna, isle mene lal me dal diya. Right? Group 4 and 5. For housewife and mine. Right? Who should witness in mail order? Already we have seen. These are all the things which LIC ka pichle wala, pichle wala rules hai. Medical examiner, employer, banker, embassy, etc. etc. Ye mene green me dala kyunki ye bohut asani hai. Right? Getting signature from our colleague. NRA or FNIO, best choice provided he also gives his residence fee. It's not that of course the customer say residence proof mangna padega, utility bill mangna padi nahi. The witness also needs to give it yaad rakna. If you are doing mail order business, jo sign karte hai, unka passport, unka visa, LIC needs to understand that you are getting signature only from a person who is abroad. 
वहां से पेपर आने के बाद यहाँ सिग्नेचर मारना नहीं चाहिए राइट इट हैज टू बी विटनेस्ड बाई अ पर्सन हु इज देर नियर हिम राइडर्स एनआरए सब पर इसको क्या क्या हम दे सकते हैं For resident group one to four, you can give only accident benefit rider or ADDP rider, whichever is there, right? Term rider allowed only to group five. PWP for minor lives only to group five. Critical illness rider not at all allowed to NRA SNF or NIO. When we are not giving critical illness rider to resident Indians, विदेशी के लिए क्यों देते हैं? Right? But it's not allowed. In case they are getting inquiries, CIRS. Not allowed for NRIs and FNIOs. Be aware of that. Right? These are the about the riders. General points. Proposals from Libya, Syria, and Ukraine. They go. Ukraine is very famous in the last six months. Now, LIC decided it long back. Yaro, that is the brain of our organization. Are to be postponed even before the problem started. We have been very very cautious for many number of years. We were not accepting. Proposals from that place. Only individual insurance is allowed. Ten R F N I O. Key man, employer, employee scheme. They are not allowed. In an N R A F N I O stays beyond one year in India and wish to stay further, they are to be treated as Indians for the insurance purpose, right? If they are continuously in India and wish to stay further, you should treat them as Indians. If an N R A frequently travels between group one to group four, we need to get an extra B. I have told you on the previous slide. A travel and residence questionnaire, and charge extra if he stays beyond three months. Because whichever place he has been staying for a longer time, residence group ka jo rules hota hai that is going to be applied. Proposals from countries which are not grouped by LIC needs to be sent to central office for individual consideration on merits. ये क्या है? Now countries मैंने cover किया इसके ऊपर countries है क्या? जरूर है. That we do not know. If you are getting a proposal from a country which is not there in the, all the five groups, eh, will you decline it? No, you have to take it, send it to central office. They will consider it on merits. Right? Malaysia of India doesn't insure foreign nationals. याद रखना, only foreign national of Indian origin we insure, not foreign nationals directly. Okay, forms used in NRA insurance, NRA questionnaire, travel and residence questionnaire, GST exemption form. Special ACR for mail order. This has this is nothing but agent's confidential report. Up to agent's limit, depending on the club member, he can give. If it is exceeding his limit, DO and SBI has to give. As simple as that. Special ACR. This is also available in branch. You can take it. Right. This is all about NR insurance. And quickly, we are going to say frequently asked questions. This is there is no scope for interaction. So, इसलिए सवाल भी मैं पूछता हूँ, जवाब भी मैं देता हूँ. Right. दोनों. Sida, Sawal, can an NRA take policy in foreign currency? Policies are issued in INR only. You cannot issue policy in foreign currency, right? This is the first question. Question two, can we accept NB check in foreign currency? Yes, very much. Receipt would be issued subject to receiving credit from the bank. Every branch can accept foreign currency instrument and we'll be sending it to our Branch, I mean bank uh, branches. They'll be uh, sending it for collection, and whatever is the amount realized on that day, BOC would be created in the branch. Okay. Can renewal premium be paid through foreign currency? Yes, very much the same formality as explained for NB check. Right. Question number four. If a person becomes an NRA or FNIO after the issue of policy, ये बहुत important सवाल है. आज वो resident Indian है. Then he becomes NRA. He goes to US. There he applies for green card in another three or four years. He becomes a US national. Should it be informed to LIC? So contract, बहुत साल है twenty पच्चीस साल है बीस पच्चीस साल है should be be informed. Legally, no is the answer, friends. Legally, there is no binding at all for the customer to inform us. Nationality legally, but it is advisable to inform LIC with an R I questionnaire in order to avail future services. समझ लीजिए, he wants to pay for, by an R E account instead of I N R. He wants to pay through foreign currency. Then LIC will ask the question: When did you become an N R I? When did you become an F N I? So instead of we waiting for LIC to ask questions, 
it is desirable and advisable to inform LIC in writing with an NRA questioner to avail future services without any hassle. So you read this also and this also. Legally, I'm telling no, but procedurally, it is better. Question number five. If a person who was in group by country settled in group two, after first US, then he goes to group two, hitless country, after the issue of policy, and if claim arises, will LIC settle? This is an important question, eh, na? The answer is this. Yes. A policy holder is free to change his place of residence into any country and his occupation. Contract sign karne pe samay kya cheez hai, wohi legally valid. Provided policy is not allowed to lapse. Agar aap panchre group se ek wala group gaya to, policy lapse kiya to, aapka policy revival nahi hoga. Kyunki group one mein regular premium plans not allowed means, eh? if you are going to lapse, Revival is as good as a fresh contract, isn't it? They will not give you new policy, so they will not revive the existing policy. So they can change. But only thing you have to remember is well before the due date, you pay the premium and save yourself. If you go to the policy lapse, kiya to, it will be a problem and you cannot revive it. Is death claim procedure same for NRA? Another important question. So policy is our work. Servicing till the end, we have to do na? unfortunate incident of death claim. Yes, it is absolutely the same for both resident Indians as well as in our eyes. But you need to understand certain differences here. See, for an accident claim, for a resident Indian, we ask, we ask for uh, uh, post-mortem report, PIR, FIR, A, sub cheese. Hai. But uh, post-mortem is not uh, legally performed in some countries, right? So what we will do? So, once I say cases are come, LIC will be considering it on merits based on the representation from the nominee that this country may, Morocco may, ye nahi hota hai, Dubai may, ye nahi hota hai. These are all the documents to uh, say that uh, he has died by accident. I say kya to LIC will automatically settle it, and uh, my agents have experienced that, friends. In the absence of postmortem, also they will be settling the claim if the law of the country doesn't. Permitted, LIC will obviously accept it. It is based on the merits of the case. Nothing to worry at all. Right? Question number seven. That's what I have. For accidental claim pertaining to NRA, will LIC insist on post-mortem police report? Yes, requirements would be insisted as per our manual, but depending on individual merits, it will be decided. DIB claim would be settled based on representation from the nominee. Right? Question number eight. And LIC settle maturity, death, surrender in foreign currency. They are paying in INR for some time. Then they became foreign citizen. How LIC will settle in foreign currency, we'll see. As per revised life insurance memorandum, we can settle money in foreign currency in proportion to the amount received by us in that currency. As yeah, simple as that. This is the policy. In the past five years, they have INR for in rupees for the first five years. Next 15 years, he is paying in foreign, foreign currency. Right? So the claim will be based on the proportion. First to five years, KLA INR may that proportion may claim settle loga. Balance foreign currency may have to that proportion may settle loga. Right? This is how we settle it. OCI is a terminology frequently used nowadays. Is OCI the same as FNIO and LIC? Already I have dealt it in the beginning slides. Yes, overseas citizen of India are treated as foreign nationals of Indian origin. See there. Not holding Indian passport. The last question. Are green card holders treated as FNIOs and allowed insurance? Yes, sir. I have told you, after revised LIM has come into practice, we treat green card holders also as FNIO and issue policy to them. Types of accounts I am switching, no time. NRE, NRO, a sub cheese or PPT may take lijiye. Otherwise, Google it, you will get the answer, right? This is not a big deal to do. Take away from today's class. This session. Almost two ganta, right? It was given by 7.35. Now the time is 9.25. You have learned anything and everything about insurance, NRA insurance. What next? Yeah. 3.2 crores Indians live abroad. Out of that 3.2 crore Indians, how many of my acquaintances are there? This is the first step you have to decide today after the session. What are the countries? Who are all the relatives? 
who are my friends, who are my friends, relatives who are staying over there. Which group does he belong to? What is the residence group guidelines? What policy I can suggest? Up to what limit I can go with VMER? All these things you have to make a prospecting list. Either two, you will be clear in preparing a prospecting list for resident Indians. A class K bar, you need to have a prospecting list for NREs also, FNIOs also. A 3.2 crore may mera share kya hota hai? Mera pai kya hota hai? How much I am going to cut in this? That is what you need to decide. Understand its very wide scope. Huge potential, very huge premium price. Beginning itself, when I bola, Swadeshi say if you are taking 1 lakh from a resident Indian, you can very easily take 5 lakh from an NRA. And the efforts will be very much less for NRA. Very much less. Five times the premium, one fifth of the effort. If you are clear in the rules and approaching the NRS and FNIO professionally, you are going to get very huge business, effortless business. Unbelievable commission for you. Unbelievable commission. Let us see some marketing aspects now. What is this plan? G1 Lab. Let me give you for age 25. I have told you, you can go up to one crore na, if they are here. Or if you are going over that, 1 crore ke liye, what is the premium for 1610? 8,32,000. For 21,15, it is 5,30,000. For 25,16, it is 4,00,000. Likewise, age-wise, I have given the limits of some assured, which can be done with the VMER only. Of course, if it is a mail order, beyond 50 lakhs, you need to get special reports which I have already taught you, assuming they are here, assuming they are coming here. You can straight away go up to one crore in this Jeevan law, see the premium. These premiums you translate into commission, my dear friends, whether it is 28% or whether it is 35% with the bonus, you decide, you know it better. This is the huge scope of NRA business and these are all the limits which can be done. And next is our most popular Jeevan Umang, so, Salka policy, right? You see, for age 25, 1 crore. For 15 year term, it is 7 lakh and odd. For a 20, it is 525. Likewise, the premium at stake for you is very huge. Effortless, I should say, if you are clear and professional in your thought process, you can do really, really, really well, my dear friends. And presentation is almost going to be finished. And now I will hand over to Ayer uh, Sir and the other. Uh, Gentlemen, to take the proceedings from here. Thank you. <coughs> Thank you, sir. Yes, sir. My subse pehle batana chaunga ek to energetic continuously jo had two hours. My to beach me maine pani piya abhi ab pani pine ja rahe. Thank you, sir. My sun raha tha, my pani pi raha tha beach me. Matlab energetic or sophisticated. And complete knowledge. अभी हमने भी NRA business वगैरह किया है. अभी first time जो है, first time believe or not believe, travel और residential questionnaire के बारे में अभी first time मैंने मतलब add हुआ है. क्यों वो जरूरी है? उसके वजह से क्या होता है? तो ये सब जो है अमन ताशर को add करने मतलब बुलाने के पहले conclusion के लिए मैं हमारा जो क्रिट सिंगाड़ा सार है उनसे मैं अनुरोध करूंगा तो ये जो है आज एक नॉलेज ओरिएंटेड सेशन ऑन बिगाफ ऑफ एजेंट आपका विचार क्या है सर सर इट्स एक्सेलेंट एंड आई वुड लाइक टू रिक्वेस्ट मिस्टर श्रीधर टू एक्सटेंड वन मोर सेशन फर्दर टू दिस एंड इन दैट वी कैन क्लियर सो मेनी अदर ड ourselves uh, and our insurers. That assurance, sir, we request you on behalf of, sir. 100% I am available for your service, sir. Thank it's you very much, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. So, this is a small reciprocation by which I can give back to my institution. Thank you very much, sir. Definitely we can sir, answer. small question, small question. Any number of questions you can ask, provided time is there for you to do. Only one question. Uh, yeah. Loan, servicing of loan, a yeah. any directly they can uh, on uh, signature on the mail only they can validate or they have to send a physical paper. 
uh, legal requirement, physical paper is required, sir, obviously. Okay. Auditing ke liye legal requirement hai na? They have to sign and give it. We, we will okay, along with the policy bond. Yeah, 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 yeah. obviously. Hassan is okay. required. Without any doubt. Right, sir. Yeah. Thank you very much. Any questions by participants, sir? No, no sir. Abhi, ja raha hu, Mr. Ayasar Ji. Thank you. Thank you very much, sir. Take three oh. to four minutes to uh, minimize and maxima, maximum conclusion. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I understand. I understand. Uh, thank you very much, Sridhar, sir. I have been receiving thousands of messages uh, requesting for the PPT. So my request to you, ki, as fast as possible, you could put, please share the PPT so that we can forward it to our uh, long waiting agent friends. I am pleased, pleased, very, very pleased to, to inform that we were more than 825 agents connected today. And uh, even now, I see about 475 agents already uh, connected with us till the end of the show. That shows us how uh -huh. popular you are, sir, and how much your presentation is good. And uh, sir, my request to you that uh, please, uh, as and when, as early as possible, we will have one more session from you to clear the doubts which are being created today by uh, our agent friends. Uh, Sita Raman sir, I will... That shows how well I have taken the session with... Uh, Very true, sir. Very true. <laughs> Sir, the whole the whole fact that I have been receiving the messages and I am not able to read them shows okay. your popularity, sir, and your sincerity towards the subject. Uh, sir, before I close this, uh, uh, my side of the story, I will just need to in make two announcements for my agent friends. You can call me at 8 o'clock in the morning to 10 और आपके डाउट्स क्लियर कर सकते हैं जो भी डाउट्स मुझसे क्लियर नहीं होंगे वो श्रीधर सर से मैं क्लियर करूंगा या तो फिर सीतारामन सर या फिर हमारी टीम मिलके आपका डाउट्स क्लियर करेंगे ये एक पॉइंट था दूसरी पॉइंट है आप मुझे जो भी क्वेश्चंस है वो आप एसएमएस मत कीजिएगा एसएमएस मत कीजिएगा सिर्फ WhatsApp कीजिएगा और मेरा नंबर आप नोट कर सकते हैं 9850429955 मैं नंबर नोट फिर से रिक्वेस्ट करता हूं नंबर Nine eight five zero four two double nine double five. आपके सवाल आप मुझे इस नंबर पे पूछ सकते हैं और आपके जवाब आपको कल या परसों जैसे ही आपको डिटेल्स मिलेंगे मैं शेयर कर दूंगा. Thank you very much, sir. I will not go into the intricacies of concluding the session because we are already overshooting our time. So, Sita Raman, sir, आपको request करता हूँ to complete this process. हर बार मैं जैसा सबसे request करता हूँ सबसे पहले तो मैं सार को बहुत बहुत धन्यवाद करना चाहूंगा उनका इतना बिजी शेड्यूल रहता है मैं प्रैक्टिकली चेन्नई जाने के बाद भी सार से मिल नहीं पाया तो तो हमें ये जो दो घंटे का जो सेशन मिला है एक किस्म का हम लोग बहुत बड़ा भाग्यवान है जो ये सेशन आज अटेंड किया मेरा पर्सनल हम्बल रिक्वेस्ट है ईच एंड एवरी वन ऑफ जो है यूट्यूब में जाइए आप जो है सुनिए और आपको जो समझ में आया उसको लिखिए अपना नोटबुक में पर्सनल नोटबुक में फर्स्ट टाइम फिर सेकंड टाइम फिर सुनिए फिर क्या क्या समझ में नहीं आया था फिर समझ में आया फिर उसको लिखिए मैं ये समझ रहा हूं इस एनआरए बिजनेस का जो कंटेंट्स सार ने पूरा दिया है उसको आपको पांच बार कम से कम यूट्यूब में देख के समझना पड़ेगा आपका अपना पर्सनल नोटबुक में मैं एक एनआरए का अप्रोच करूंगा तो मेरे पास क्या क्या कंटेंट से मैंने क्या लेना चाहिए क्या नहीं लेना चाहिए पूरा एक कुप्र के साथ आप जो है आपका प्रपोजल सबमिट हुआ है तो वो क्या तो वो पास हो के बाहर निकलना चाहिए कोई भी मतलब उसमें एडिशनल रिक्वायरमेंट्स एलआईसी का हायर अथॉरिटी से अंडर से नहीं मतलब डिमांड आना चाहिए उस किस्तम का आपका आज का सेशन का पूरा अकॉर्डिंग टू दैट यूट्यूब में जाके बार बार जो है कम से कम तो मैं रेकमेंड करूंगा फाइव टाइम्स आपको सुनना पड़ेगा सुनने से ही आपको लर्निंग जब मोर मोर एंड मोर लर्निंग होगा आपका यर्निंग अपने आप बढ़ेगा विदाउट लर्निंग आपका यर्निंग बढ़ने का चांस नहीं है ये सब कुछ क्यों कर रहे हैं हम आपका जो है फाइनेंशियल एक ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन को आपका पिछले साल तक जो इनकम था इस साल डबल हो और इसके लिए हमने मिशन एमडीआरटी जो है एक बेंचमार्क रखा है और इस मिशन एमडीआरटी का एक ही सिद्धांत है हर ब्रांच में 51 एमडीआरटी हो मिनिमम 
हर डिवीजन में फाइव नॉट एट एम हो और पूरा भारत वर्ष में मेरा जो है मदर ऑफ इंडिया मतलब मेरी माँ एल का फिफ्टी थाउजेंड प्लस एम हो और एल का मार्केट शेयर नाइन्टी वन पॉइंट सिक्स हो इसी के पीछे इसी का प्रयत्न से हम लोग एक पागलपन लेके मतलब निकल पड़ा इसमें हमको अच्छे अच्छे जो है ट्रेनर्स अच्छे अच्छे डेवलपमेंट ऑफिसर्स अच्छे अच्छे एस अच्छे अच्छे एजेंट परफॉर्मड एजेंट्स सपोर्ट सपोर्ट कर रहे हैं सिर्फ आपको जो आपको मिल रहा है कंटेंट्स इसको सिर्फ एक्टिविटी कीजिए इंप्लीमेंटेशन कीजिए आपको कितना भी नॉलेज मिला कितना भी आपको पर्सनालिटी है सब कुछ है स्किल है सब कुछ है जब तक आप इंप्लीमेंटेशन नहीं करेंगे देर इज नो आउटकम देर इज नो आउटकम आपको एक्टिविटी करना ही पड़ेगा आपका नॉलेज को इंप्लीमेंट करना ही पड़ेगा इतना बड़ा एन का जो कोर्स है मैं बताता हूँ ये एन आर आई सी को जो सार ने आज पूरा बताया है ये जो है ट्रेनर्स के पास थर्टी थाउजेंड रुपीज जो है सेशन का चार्जेस है इस थर्टी थाउजेंड चार्जेस को मल्टीप्लाई आज जो है एट हंड्रेड एंड थर्टी फाइव लोग जो है जुड़ के सुन रहे थे और प्लस जो यूट्यूब में देख रहे हैं अभी मतलब कल जो है थाउजेंड क्रॉस हो जाएगा नौ बजे तक तो ये सब मल्टीप्लाई कर रहे तो मतलब ये एक अंडा जो सोने का अंडा का जो है मुर्गी जो है विदाउट कास्ट मतलब आपको मुफ्त में मिल गया लेकिन उसको कैसे यूटिलाइज करके आप अपना प्रोफेशन में आप इसको कन्वर्ट करके कल्टीवेट करके क्यूमलेटिव करके आप जितना कमाएंगे अभी आपका हाथ में वो आपका हाथ में सिर्फ इम्प्लीमेंटेशन के वजह से होगा तो इसी के साथ आज का जो सेशन के कम्प्लीट करने के पहले मैं आशा जी कम्प्लीट कर दू यस सर तो मैं वन सेकेंड जो है श्री श्रीधर सर को बहुत बहुत सारे दिल से जो है धन्यवाद करता हूँ हमारा एक बहुत बड़ा मतलब अनुमान था जैसा ही मैंने मतलब थोड़ा एक महीना पहले सार का पीपीटी देखा था देखते पहले तो सार का पूरा सब पीपीटी देखता था लेकिन एन आर का पीपीटी देखने के बाद मैंने दिमाग में एक ही चीज लाया एन का सेशन कराऊंगा तो सार से कराऊंगा बस मेरा जित था ये उसके लिए मैं थोड़ा सा मतलब नेटवर्क किया सब कुछ किया सार जानते हैं तो मेरे को पूछते भी है आपने कैसा मेरे तक पहुंचा करके तो पहुंचना पड़ता है किसके लिए मेरा एजेंट ब्रदर्स एंड सिस्टर्स के लिए बहुत बहुत धन्यवाद सर जैसा क्रिट सर ने बताया है हम एक अकूमलेट ऑफ जो है लोगों का जो क्वेश्चन डाउट पूरा ये करेंगे उसको जो है लोग कितना एन बिजनेस करने के बाद उनको क्या क्या ऑब्स्टिकल्स आया वो सब कटा कटा करेंगे कटा करने के बाद फिर एक और एक सेशन करेंगे नियरर टू अक्टूबर और नवंबर में yes, तो बहुत बहुत थैंक्स सर प्लीज सर कुछ बोलना चाहते हैं यस सर थैंक यू वेरी मच ईच एंड एवरीवन एंड वन सेकेंड श्रीधर सर बहुत बहुत धन्यवाद थैंक यू वेरी मच गुड नाइट एंड जय हिंद Thank you, sir. Good night, Thank Jay. You, sir. Thank you, sir. Ayur, uh, sir, na the PPT will come. Sir, can I WhatsApp? Na? Yes, sir. Can you convert and share? Okay, sir. Okay, sir. Yes, sir. Na class at that day. Okay, sir. Just convert it into PDF and you can share. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All Thank the very best. Uh, love you all, friends. Thank you. Good night. Yes, sir. Good night. Good night of you, sir. Good night.